Yo, what is up, boys? It's just my life now, huh? 259, and I'm seeing a wall of lates. Thank you to the real ones out there who understand how clocks work. Appreciate that. Hello, 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 boys. How do I sound? How do I sound? How does the music sound? Sick. Okay, I don't mean... <laughs> thank you. Hey, thank you. I appreciate that. I didn't... I wasn't asking if I sound like I have sick. I got COVID. I was more so asking if the volume sounds all right in terms of... I could put on my not sick voice. Uh, it's called treble only. <laughs> How's it going, guys? The music also sounds sick. Cool, tight, dope. What is up, boys? It's been a while, huh? Three days? Is that right? Three days of no stream? I'm not even a streamer anymore. Can I admit it? I am barely even a streamer. What with my COVID head ass? But boy, have I been a YouTuber. I've uploaded like twice on the side channel. I uploaded uh, two exclusives on the VOD channel. You put out an hour of SAP content a day. I was out here grinding, bro. Who watched the SAP VODs? Those SAP VODs went dumb hard. Can we get emotes on the screen? We're working on that. We're trying to build our own custom URL or overlay. Uh, and this one sucks. It was nice. It was nice, right? I think I might keep it going. I didn't get time to record today, unfortunately, but I did. I, I recorded, what, three of them? I think I recorded three. Uh, and people seem to enjoy them. The more personal, uncut. Why is the Christmas tree still up? Hear me out. It looks pretty. That's all I got for you. It looks pretty, and what the, f like, how the hell else am I going to decorate it? I think it looks good. Bro versus bro with toast, where it at? Oh my god, did I literally upload it and you don't know about it? Did 60,000 people find it and not you? Seems like that could be the case. It's right here, bro. Look. Look at it. Look at it. Here's the VOD. I also uploaded three exclusive Super Auto Pets VODs. One where I got the level 3B, which was very hard. It took me about three hours of grinding to get that. Anyway, boys, hope you guys are all doing well. Glad to be back live. I feel the best I have felt since contracting COVID-19. Which, I don't know. You guys all know, right? I got COVID. Everybody's well aware that I got COVID. Everybody knows. Everybody knows. I got COVID the same time you did. Bro, we got COVID the same time everybody did. The COVID cases per day have skyrocketed. To over a million, I think, in the U.S. alone. Which is crazy. Check it out. These are COVID cases in the U.S. 1.4 million people got COVID in one day. That's... A high, 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 high number of people. The biggest peak before that was 226,000. So, flatten the curve. <laughs> Everybody's getting Omniscron. I, I think it's a goddamn inevitable bitch. Deaths? Pog! I mean, <laughs> That, <laughs> that it's not at a peak. Uh, right. 
<laughs> Woo! Phew. All right. Clipped. Well, thank God I'm going to play anime music, so the entire VOD's going to get deleted anyway, baby. Let's go! Sing! Song! Sing! The UK flattened the curve by doing absolutely nothing. Let's check if that's true. UK vaccination rate. It is... 70% fully vaccinated. The US vaccination rates... 62. So that's where you got to be. But also we have a shit ton of people. Vermont, 78% of the people are vaccinated. Uh, Alabama, 48% of the people are vaccinated. Although, they don't got to worry about that COVID-19. They got to worry about that in Moran. You know how it be. Anyway, boys, today we're going to be watching Death Note. Let's go, Death Note, baby! Do you guys see Toast got banned? Okay. Look. I remember taking some blame for getting Amaranth and Indie Fox banned. I directly am the reason that Zane got banned. If you remember, I made him change his name to uh, meatspin.com, and then he got banned off of Twitch. You know, Pokimane, I don't really take a lot of blame for, but I will say this, on hindsight, looks bad. This looks really bad. Content awareness. They don't get that and they'll just watch it freely you know it'll be i'll go nuts on russian just chatting mm -hmm. and i'll watch some like they just watch naruto have you ever heard of <laughs> russian dubs no they're terrible <laughs> they have it so bad in russia so they'll it'll be the japanese version mm -hmm. you know it'll be naruto and then loudly over it will be a russian guy going sasuke <laughs> and it's just both audios they can't isolate it because they don't uh. they don't get that and they'll just watch it freely so this is an interview i did with toast november 18th content awareness so it'd be like a human doing it mm -hmm. and then it's like they could be wrong so they never ever file copyright claims unless they are specifically told to do so um so you can get away i mean like <laughs> i used to tell my friend i won't say who but huge in anime he was like a 100 viewer andy i was like just watch anime on stream just do it. You probably won't get banned because these companies are not <laughs> keeping track. They don't care. They like there's way bigger problems of their content getting stolen. So just watch it on stream, react to it live instead of doing like watch parties. You'll get way more viewers and you'll grow. And if you do get banned, you'll already have grown and you'll the ban will go away in a few. Wait, who am I talking to? Mm. Oh, <laughs> wait, real quick, let's check something out. <laughs> oh whoops uh <laughs> you know hey at least now i know when i give him advice he'll listen to me so that's that's cool you know <laughs> that let's say let's just say i'm inspirational i'm inspirational of some sorts He'll come back bigger while well, listening to the following conversation. And I always think getting banned on Twitch is great marketing, great PR, because gets 100%. everyone talking about it. We literally outlined everything that's about to happen. We are basically like uh, code geassing it, okay? We are Lelouch, all right? And we set this all up. Everything is working as expected. This is scripted. Everybody's freaking out about the toast ban like we didn't plan it out over two months ago. Hey, we'll catch up, baby. That's right. We are going nuts. Am I from the future? Yes, I am. All right. I can tell you many things that are about to happen this year, including uh, nothing will be done about climate change. All right. That is my prediction. Look forward to it happening.
Also, Apple will release a new iPhone. Okay, I got a lot more of those coming. A lot more of those coming. Anyway, boys, welcome back to the stream. Let's see who our rivals... Uh, how our rivals doing today? 31K? Bro, what? At 3 p.m. still? I mean, usually she dips to like the 20K territories. <gasps> All right. Well, that's our goal for today is to beat Lo-Fi Girl. So either she needs to drop by 20K or I need to go up by 20K. But hey, one way or the other, I'm sure it might happen. Back to studying sessions. Man, school really does just stay happening. <laughs> it just it's just always there, right? It's just always there. God damn. There's always people in school. All right. Whatever. I got COVID too. Yo, who got COVID in chat? Press seven. If you don't have COVID, just smiley face. Just nod and move on. Let's see my COVID carries. Who's got COVID? No, you guys are fucking with me. Okay, wait, that's a more equal distribution. Uh, distribution. That's still a lot of COVID, though. I had it for Christmas. That sucks. Yeah, that's a lot of COVID, man. That shit spreads. Do a poll? Sure. Do you have COVID? Yes? No. Have it right now. I don't care if you had it a month ago. If someone in your direct family has it, you can vote yes, because you'll probably get it. Uh, all right, let's see. Yeah, it seems like, uh, I mean, that's still a decent chunk. That's like uh, almost 1,200 of you guys, over 1,200. Have COVID-19 guaranteed straight the fuck up. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. All right, tagged the entirety of my Discord to let them know I'm live, and I am looking at about 20% of my chat. That's a big enough sample size, polling 8,000 people, that I can assume that 20% of my chat has COVID, which is a lot. 20%. That's a crazy amount. Now do other diseases. <laughs> Hey, do you or a loved one... Hey, let's do a poll chat. Let's find out if you or a loved one have mesothelioma. Uh, like, that would be so fun. And, and wait, if you vote yes, maybe I could get you compensation. What? That seems like, like, like a scam, but it's not. <laughs> Let me tell you more. Let me tell you how you could be entitled to financial compensation. Have I played Genshin? I have never played Genshin, and I have no interest in playing Genshin. Because in my mind, it is still knockoff uh, Breath of the Wild that a Chinese company completely stole and then put cute anime girls into. And then everybody in the Genshin Impact community makes me not want to play Genshin Impact. They just seem far too passionate. For me, a casual player. Like, I'm just trying to, like, I would just try to play a game, and it's, like, it's a, it's crazy out there. Too many people are too parasocially attached to the anime people. Including Tectone. I think Tectone gets off on people fighting him. <laughs> I follow Tectone on Twitter, and I'll see it every other day, like, ugh, these people keep dogging me about Genshin. Look at this. And I'm like, yeah, I mean, fair, but it seems like you kind of like it. It seems like you like when they start riling you up because then you're like, these these Genshin fuckers said this? The whole thing seems like a drama-filled environment. 
Best case, you fall for a gacha game that sucks money out of your wallet. Worst case, it is your whole entire personality. And neither of those sound appealing to me. I would rather play with the cute animals on Super Auto Pets. Yes, I got Toast Band. Ah. Anyway, boys, hope you are all doing well. Today's the first day where I felt good enough to go back live. Uh, and I'm glad I did. We have a, a few things I want to do today. I, I want to do a Reddit recap. We got some unusual memes. Uh, there's this thing that someone came out with called Twitch Tweets that I thought would be fun to play around with. So we'll play around with it. Uh, as well as some other shit. So we got some, we got some stuff to do. Marbles? You know what we might do today? I don't know if we'll do marbles per se, but I, there is this popular thing I saw Maya do, and I think E-Rob is probably the person who deserves the credit. Uh, but the spin the wheel thing seems pretty pog. It's basically like marbles, but you spin a wheel instead. And uh, and I wouldn't mind I wouldn't mind doing a wheel stream. Having the wheel control the stream, and you guys get to pick what's on the wheel. Imagine, giant spinny wheel, and then you pull it, and then whatever the wheel lands on, I have to do. It's a boring version of marbles. I don't think it's this, I think you can put, you can change the stakes of things so it's not the same as marbles. For example, like, you could have 20% chance of, like, gifting a sub, but then a 1% chance of, like, shaving bald. Which is different than marbles, where everything has an equal percent chance of occurring. That makes sense. It's basically marbles with different odds. Which can be good, because then you can put in riskier things, and there's a less chance of it happening. I think marbles is probably overall more exciting, but hey, hey, let's try new things, you know, in this world. Miskip did this. He stole this as well from E Rob. I believe E Rob is the is the is the man I'll give credit to founding this and making it popular. Uh when is Toast showing up? I don't think Toast wants to pop up here. Maybe Spaghetti Boy could, though. One Piece? I've been catching up on One Piece. And let me tell you... Holy shit. Have I gotten old, or is Usopp more annoying than ever? I mean, that boy does not shut the fuck up. He's nonstop. He does not quit. He's just like a siren. All he does is be very loud. And I said this, and then everybody retorted, if you think he's bad, Sanji's really the worst. He's just a constant horn dog. And I thought about it, and I was like, you might be right. But in the exact arc I am watching of the show, Sanji is not in it at all. And then the little piece he was in it, he was very cool and badass. So I can't hate on Sanji at the moment because he is cool and badass and barely in the show. But perhaps when he goes back to his normal homostasis, homeostasis, <laughs> I guess he's kind of the... He got banned, which we knew about. Pokey got banned for Avatar The Last Airbender. Mizkif did not get banned. And then uh, Hassan got a DMCA for MasterChef. That turned out to be fake. Uh, and then Toast got banned watching the last episode of Death Note last night, which I was watching with him. I was annoyed because that's a really good episode. The last episode, I mean, it's not the last episode, but episode 25 is a great episode. You didn't see it. He got banned for watching episode 25 of Death Note, but I kind of have a theory. All right, check it out. Check it out. If I do this, Death Note episode one. If I do this, it pops up. Like, this is not from Death Note, right? This is not a, a verified uploader. This is Happy Creeper XX. This is a random ass person. But I can find it. Oh, well. I didn't expect it to anyway. 
But like, okay, what about episode 14? Random episode. I can also find it. Again, from a different random uploader from Brainwashers. Thing about us or the death. But if I type in episode 25, it doesn't come up. Which is which is interesting, right? Surely those re-uploaders probably uploaded episode 25, but the only thing that persists are either huge broken up parts of the episode or reactions where the cam is the largest part of the video. Which is interesting that like episode 25, all of a sudden things start to change. I mean, episode 21 even. It's like, why are, well, why is this one here? I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of interesting. The further you go, the harder they are to find. It's, yeah, that's what it feels like. I don't know why that's the case. I don't know if they're more stringent the deeper you get, but kind of smart. It makes people pay. <laughs> so you think the people who make Death Note are like, hey, let's just leave the first 10 episodes. Like, let's just leave them on YouTube. We'll get the money because we'll claim it, but we won't take it down. Episode 11 and on, just fucking ax them. Just take down everything. They're hooked by then. They're going to want to go watch. Where are they going to find it? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. From 3,000 other illegal sites where you can easily watch anime by just Googling it. Anime is one of the weirdest things in the world. Where, like, it's it, it's, it fucks me up. Wait. Nothing much. What's up with you? I cannot believe I fell for that. <laughs> oh, never mind. <laughs> ne never mind. Never mind. That was much easier than I thought. Damn, that's sick. Pirating is easy. Bring pirating back. You know what I mean? Bro, it's not our fault. Hey, I should be allowed to pirate. I still have a subscription to Crunchyroll. Sorry, I don't want to sit through 800 poorly edited, ep uh, edited episodes of One Piece when I can just pirate it off of One Piece and then see it in a much better format. Like, what do you want from me? I bought the rights to watch it legally. I just chose not to because it's a worse product. I felt 15 again. I had to get U-Torrent on all my computers. Oh. Anyway, boys. Shout out to NordVPN, proud sponsor of the stream. Nord is your one-stop shop. If you guys ever want to get around some region locked content. <laughs> Actually, it's Tuesday, so I do need to do a Nord ad read. You know, it's just it's just it's just good timing. It's just smart business is what it is. <laughs> it's just smart business is what it is. Uh, more importantly than region law content, though, is they are trying to get you to get Nord Pass, which is just like a password manager of sorts, where you can put all your passwords in one place and it's all safe and secure. So Nord Pass is the real thing. I think you can type exclamation point Nord Pass in chat. Um... Or exclamation point Nord in, uh, in chat. And yeah, it just remembers complex passwords, autofills forms online, lets you fill it in from anywhere, yada, yada, yada. And you go to nordpass.com forward slash Ludwig for a premium deal. Here it is. It was on the Forbes website. I don't know why that matters, but it was there. So that's cool. Wow. 
<laughs> That's a game changer. Had it been on a shitty website, I don't know if I'd be all into it. But if it was on Forbes, I mean, that's kind of pog champ. Uh. Alright, boys. Anyway, today we're probably going to do some Reddit recap, some unusual memes. Hi, Ludwig. Have you seen the new Attack on Titan OP? I watched the new Attack on Titan OP and the new episode. I was, uh, without spoiling anything for anybody, it was, you know, the crowd went mild. That's what I'll say. The crowd went mild. Why do other YouTubers get two years plus four months? I don't think it's for Nord Pass, and if it is, then I'm gonna cause a stink. Um... But yeah, like it was, it was alright, man. It was alright. It was, you know, as far as episodes go, it, I would rate it, you know. It was, it was, it was mild. It was mild. That's all I'll say. Anyway, let's check this thing out. Are you a parasocial Andy? Guess who tweeted what? Prove that you are your favorite streamer's biggest super fan with Twitch tweets. This was made by somebody who posted it on LSF. It contains eight streamers. Lamau, I'm in there. <laughs> Which, uh, PogChamp. And uh, also, Miz, Hassan X, Charlie, Pokey, Soda, and Saikuno. The big eight of Twitch, who could forget? I'm pretty sure I could 100% this. Like, there's no universe I don't get this. Who made this tweet at Barack Obama want to play Among Us? This Oh, wow. This is actually tough. This feels like a pokey tweet. Because I remember that a bunch of the people from OTV were tweeting at people to play Among Us. And I think Pokey did that probably right after the AOC thing, maybe. Yeah. After the AOC thing, she wrote, I love Among Us. It's allowed for so many unexpected crossovers. Thank you to the viewers and friends. Want to play Among Us at Barack Obama. That's easy enough. I'm so lonely. That's a Mizkif tweet. Oh! Oh, that's so fucked. It's so much different with the picture. Like, without the picture, it's depressing. With the picture, it's a meme. God damn it. All right, I got rolled there. I got rolled there. That's... I lose? I lose. I'm a loser. Straight up, I lose. It's over now. You're kidding me. I got six on my first try. Okay. All right. You guys think you're hot shit? How about, Chad? It's your turn. It's your turn. Who tweeted this? All right. Is it Soda? Saikuno? Miz or Charlie? Who tweeted it, boys? All right, the poll is up right now. Poll's right here. Who tweeted this out, you you wise? You, oh, you're so smart. You're so intelligent. Still can't believe there's people out there who haven't seen Two Girls, One Cup. People are stuck between Soda and Charlie. But I think Charlie is in the lead at the moment. Although it's going down, interestingly enough. I think 5,000 votes is enough to call it. I'm going to end the poll. You guys voted Charlie. Let's see. Yeah, that's a Charlie tweet. A soda tweet would be like, Two girls, one cup is so tame. I fuck so many bitches with way more cups than that. <laughs> and that's, that's like how soda tweets. All these L.A. whores are going to get my cup in their buttholes. <laughs> and that's, so that's like every soda tweet. All right. Next up, uh, my favorite Bacardi Spice cocktail is a Spiced in Mule. Making one on stream in a minute. What the fuck is this tweet? Who tweeted this? Who the fuck tweeted this? Saikuno, Soda, Pokey. 
or X? I I don't know. This is this seems like a I don't want to make the poll bias. But I I don't know who the hell this is. Who does the smiley face with the nose, too? You guys are voting for Pokey on mass over 50%, that's majority. All right, let's see. It was X! Oh! Did you only get one? Oh, guys, only one? I mean, that's pathetic. That's p Imagine only getting one, bro. Going live to watch the Game Awards with Bacardi Spice. Let's go. My favorite Bacardi Spice cocktail is a Spice and Mule. Making one on stream in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, this is the worst sponsorship of all time. Holy shit. I mean, if you're a big streamer, they really just pay, they'll pay anyone to say anything. <laughs> like what what XQC frog is reading this like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> Bacardi Spice Rum. Add it to the cart, honey. The more likely if Add it to the cart, mom. That's great. That's great. Bacardi Spice Rum. All right. Now I am about to go what I like to call sicko mode because I know exactly what my peers do. Buying a car today? That's Hassan. And he lied. He didn't do it. Rainbow Road. What the fuck? That makes no sense, but it's so positive. Oh, Saikuno. We raise over 100k for No Kid Hungry. Um, yeah, it's me. It's your boy. Obvious. Thank you for that freebie. Nothing will ever beat coming home from school, firing up Halo 2 and hopping on Xbox Live and getting told my mom is getting fucked by the whole lobby. Charlie. All moved in. Any girls want to come over? Pokey. I was debating if it was soda, but he didn't move. Just picked my nose and didn't realize I had pepper seeds on my fingers and now my nose burns. <laughs> oh, fuck. That's Hassan. There's nobody that's that dumb. Oh, no. I thought it was the dumb himbo. Shit. I thought it was the big dumb himbo, Hassan. No, it's soda, dude. In my mind, Soda only tweets about sex. So it'd be like, um, just fingered a girl and touched pepper seeds and didn't realize. Now she's in the bathroom freaking out. Sad face. And that's what I feel like a Soda Poppin would be. I feel like that's what he would tweet. <laughs> that's, that's all I've like pigeonholed him to only tweeting about sex. God damn. Well, I rolled you fucks. I'll tell you that much. Only five. All right. I'm going to give you guys one more try. I'm going to give you guys actually one more try. If I beat you, chat, if I beat you. Okay. First of all, we're going to refresh because this one does not fucking count. This one does not fucking count. This is not a legal tweet. We're going to skip this one. If I beat you, everybody in the chat right now has to like the live stream. Okay. That's a rule. Everybody in the chat has to like the live stream. If I lose, however, I'll tweet anything you want on my Twitter account. Do we have an accord? Is it a deal? All right, we're going to do a best of three starting now. Best of three for the tweets starting now. Boys, let's get to it. First up. I'm going to refresh this one because it doesn't count. No one's allowed to say scam because I said I would do this. Uh, who tweeted this? Is it Hassan, Charlie, 
Saikuno or Ludwig? Scam, 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 scam. Holy shit, if you lost your money on Squid Grape. This is either Hassan. This is, look, it's not Saikuno. That's it. It's not me and Saikuno because I know I didn't tweet this. Yeah, I think you guys have the right idea. It has to be Ersan or Charlie. But I, I think Charlie's probably right. Because I think Hassan would probably be a little less um, um, chastising about it. All right, Charlie is your guess. That is correct. We'll go next. Again, if I lose, you guys can tweet anything on my account. No cheating, guys. Be chill. Be chill and don't cheat. I love politics. Oh, that's a hard one. Is this bait? There's no way. It's it's either the biggest freebie of all time or debating. All right, who tweeted it? I love politics. This was literally the day of the election? No, this is a year after the election. November 12th, 2021. I thought this was 2020. So this is a few months ago. Hassan, 50%. Pokey, 11. Ludwig, 17. Yeah, Hassan has majority. I think you guys are probably right about this. Uh, it's probably Hassan, so let's lock it in. Uh, and let's see. Is it uh, Hassan? <laughs> Or is it another streamer, perhaps? Oh. Oh, did you fall for the bait? Did you only get one point, chat? Did you forget your streamer is a journalist? Yeah, he's a bit into the political landscape. Oh, no. You probably forgot that I Love Politics was a caption for an image of Hassan baiting Ted Cruz to retweet Ted Cruz like porn on 9-11. Yeah, you probably did forget all that. You fools, my turn. <sighs> Just doing some late night gardening with my new shovel. Thanks Soda Pop and TV for being poor. Mizkiff bought the shovel from Soda on the charity stream. Pokimane tweeted at Barack Obama. What the fuck? This is XQC in reply to Gordo. I, I don't even need to do more. I don't even need to do more. I have already beaten you. I have already crushed you like a grape. Absolutely thrashed. Scam, 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 scam. Yeah, that's fucking right, kids. I scammed you. And if you're going to get scammed in my stream, just know the rest of the world is just waiting to fuck you. If my dumb ass can scam you. Imagine being tall. How embarrassing. Who tweeted it out, boys? Everybody's convinced that it is Charlie. Why is no an option? Anyway, you're right about Charlie. Next! Uh, dude, we already saw this one. We already saw this one. There's only like eight tweets in this fucking website. <sighs> All right, this one's Charlie again. I don't even need to do the poll. Are you kidding? This is Pokey. We saw this. This is XQC. We saw this. <laughs> All right, who, tw <laughs> who tweeted out the Fire Nation attacked? 
I, I'll let, I'm curious who tweeted out. Oh, was it Pokemon right after getting banned? Oh, Tuffy. Ludwig beat me in Mario. I'm such a pussy. <laughs> who tweeted out? I'm such a pussy. Was it Saikuno? Was it Hassan? Who plays Mario? Because he's played games before. Or was it Ms. Kiff? Yeah. I'm so lonely. Really? It's pokey. Okay, this one is good. This one's good. Finally a good one. Soda. Hassan. Saikuno. Ludwig. To celebrate Christmas, I'm going to eat a red and green Skittle at the same time no one can stop me. Everyone's saying soda poppin'? Wait, really? That's a real tweet? Why did the fuck did he tweet that out? That was so lame. <laughs> this is pokey. This is me. Are you kidding me? Okay, this is a funny tweet. <laughs> Who the fuck tweeted this out? Ludwig, Ms. X, or, um, oh, excuse me, Saikuno. Everyone is leaning towards Mizkif. So let's go with Mizkif. Dude. Oh. All right. This one surely is it. No content. X. Pokey. Miz. Soda. Could have been any of them. You guys are saying XQC did it? Let's see. Oh, are you kidding me? It wasn't even all caps. This cost 53K. Oh, I wonder who fucking had the $53,000 purchase here. Um, hmm. 53K? It's probably fucking Ludwig! <laughs> I don't know. I don't know who the dude This one's great, though. This seems like pokey. Is it just me or does this kind of feel like pokey energy? This gives me some heavy pokey vibes. Coming and shitting the strongest combo the human body has. All right, everyone says it's Charlie. Dude. Okay, this one's pretty recent. The MasterChef meta is over. Is it basically XQC or Hassan? Yeah, it's Hassan. Dude, this is... You guys are going to get a perfect score. At least people can't over-exaggerating me making a million a month off my viewers anymore. Charlie... Pokey. Okay, you guys are all spamming Pokey, so we're going to go with Pokey. X won me a bear. I mean, fucking, obviously, it's a son. Okay, I tried to debate you guys. Yeah, it's Saikuno, man. It's Saikuno. I miss Twitch sad face. Thank you. 
you guys are so dumb. You actually thought this was me? Bro, look at the date. September 26th? Also, I've never tweeted that out. I mean, I know you're thinking of like a marble where I almost tweeted that out, but I tweeted out about the cat instead. But regardless, this was in December and this tweet happened in, in September. All right, so I have to be 19. Fuck it. Let's do it, baby. Really? This is the first one? Really? You guys get tweets from like yesterday. I get everything feels weird and off. Nothing makes sense right now, but I'm happy. So fuck it, I guess. I mean, that's pokey. She blurred out fuck. Who the hell else would blur out the word fuck? Dude, he muted himself. Like, that's such odd behavior. Who the fuck bleeps themselves on Twitter? Like, seriously? Why? All right, it's one to one. It's one to one, boys. All right, you guys go first. Who tweeted this out? Dude, you guys are probably cheating, man. You guys are probably cheating, you rascally little bastards. Hassan? Yeah, of course. I got a fucking toothbrush for Christmas for my mom, and she said, you're a millionaire, buy the toothpaste. Oh, from a month ago? That's a real hard one. Okay, everyone's spamming Mizkif. Don't even need to ask. Halloween slut fits making me have to jack off in bathrooms at Halloween house parties. Hashtag depression. Hashtag hard boners. This could be anybody. Buying a car today. It's a lot of Hassans in chat. Literal scamathon happening now. I'm going to throw up a poll. FC Rolex and Donkey Kong German. All right, Saikuno wins. Yeah, that's true. Roblox has been offline for 24 hours. God help us. I mean, the only other person that could have tweeted this is maybe Hassan, and he wasn't even on the list. Just heard Smash Mouth broke up. Don't talk to me. I need some time. Okay, Charlie again. 
VTubers are amazing and you're all a bunch of losers. You're just jealous. I have a cutie pie anime girlfriend who appreciates me. In fact, I have like eight of them. I'm subbed and everything. All of them love me for who I am and you're jealous. I'm living my best life and you can't tell me what I can and can't do. <sighs> my God, dude. It's like it reads like a Trump tweet. It's just so obviously him. If there's one social skill that I've mastered over the years, it's burning bridges. I'm the best at it and no one comes close. We should have done, we should have, I should have realized there weren't that many tweets and I should have just taken the W. Should have been best of one. This is bullshit. This is bullshit. Too many retweets, repeats. All right, soda. Oh! Boom, baby! There's no XQC in the poll. <laughs> Everybody knows the second um, Ludwig was XQC. <laughs> then why would you vote at soda? It doesn't even make sense. This, the, fir the first Ludwig was XQC. Everybody knew that. Ever since he dyed his hair, he's the new XQC, uh, the new Ludwig. <laughs> All right. We'll count you guys at eight and you start from now. Who tweeted this out? In 2020, Pokey, Ludwig, Saikuno, or Miz. You guys are at eight right now. Or nine, excuse me, nine. Are oh, you guys are going with Pokimane? Oh, well, it looks like I wasn't too far off, you fuckers. All right, my turn. So I have to beat, I have to beat nine. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you dead ass? That's the whole tweet? That's everything? That's the entire tweet. It's not me. It's not Hassan. It could be Pokey or Mizkiff. I'm going to go with Miz. Oh, fuck. I'm starting to look like an anime character. It was Charlie. It was a shirtless pic of him. I want to look at it because he looks hot. Just doing some late night gardening with my new shovel is Mizkiff after he won the golden shovel. 2021 felt like 2020 DLC is something so normy that I can only expect it from Hassan. If you post on Reddit, you should go to jail. Yes, this includes myself. This is also Hassan. I was actually with him when he tweeted this. I had a spider crawl into my pants before I was put uh, gonna put them on last night. The spider's serious. Now I'm getting, putting, start putting spider heads on little toothbrush. What the fuck? I had a spider crawl into my pants right before I was going to put them on last night. This war is getting serious now. I'm going to start putting spider heads on little toothpicks around the house to let them know I'm not fucking around. I, that has to be soda. Only because the way he types serious. Because he writes SRS. Massive ego literally cannot be stopped. I'm the best. I'm literally the best. Nothing can stop me. Who cares if my dick can fit in a toilet paper roll? It doesn't stop me from being the literal best. Get on my level if you can even reach that high. Oh, wait, you can't because I'm so far ahead, bitch. Soda. Clout is one hell of a drug. Pokey. Yeah. 
I kissed two handsome males at Ludwig at Austin. It was X. Does anyone recognize me? I'm kind of a big deal. Hello? All caps, XQC. Oh, this Valkyrie blue light drama is annoying. It's taking away attention from my stream. I had hilarious clips today. And no one cares. Oh, what a selfish bitch. I can't believe it. I'm livid. <laughs> That's a fire tweet. Oh, X again. Um, I'm doing this live stream. $25,000 worth of trash picked by my viewers. Soda. We raised over 100K for No Kid Hungry. Ludwig. Half. B Halloween spelled quirky as I kuno. All the other Twitch streamers are getting McLaren's GTRs, R8s, 911s, GT3s, but everyone knows the V6 Toyota Camry is Hassan's car. I am met Saikuno, smiley face is me. Absolutely wrecked my cousin last night in Boomerang Foo and Mario Kart. No mercy just because they're 11 was Hassan. And I also don't believe it because he can't game for shit. Master Chef is one of the most entertaining piece of content I've binged in the longest time, and all I eat is fast food, buggers, and toenails. Uh, only because of the diet, this is XQC, because who the hell else eats that? I'm the first person to hang out with Mr. Beast and lose money, is Ludwig. Ebuy deserved to win streamer of the year, he's on another level, is Ludwig. Moving to Las Vegas, I'll be back on streams soon, is Saikuno. East Coast feels like home, is Pokey, when she went to New York. Just picked my nose and didn't realize I had pepper seeds, that's soda. I tested a dog collar myself to see how much they hurt, is Ludwig. Sprite is God tier soda is uh, something that is uh, it's either X or Charlie. I'm going to go with um, Charlie because it's not all caps. <gasps> they were roommates. All right, there it is, boys. I beat your ass fair and square. You guys know the drill. Everybody has to like the stream. Come on, boys. You know the drill. Don't fuck with me. You know the drill. Wah, wah, scam. Eat shit. You got fucking rolled. You got absolutely smoked and you're mad about it. The stream does not continue until it's at 10K, boys. I rolled you and smoked you. Isn't it literally 2-2? Two, two? No. No, it's, li it's literally not. We have not played four games. Ah, uh, the sweet taste of victory. Thanks, guys. All right, let's get to it then. And by it, I mean, let's get to the Reddit recap, baby. It's time for the Reddit recap, Reddit recap. So go and join our slash line with a Oh. <laughs> hey. <laughs> so I still have COVID. All right. That's the thing about it. It kind of sticks around. The sweet, sweet Rona, however, cannot transfer across microphones. So you guys are all safe as we dive into the Reddit recap. So let's take a look at it, boys, and see the top posts from the past week, starting with what it's like to be a moderator for Ludwig Ogren from my moderator, Tim. Yeah, Tim, Tim, the old Ludwig. Tim, yeah, Tim, Tim used to clip everything that ever happened on my stream ever. And then I met him in real life and we had a great lunch and then he stopped watching my streams. And that's the story of Tim, smiley face. I didn't forget Tim. Tim just actually doesn't show up in chat much anymore. Well, Tim, what's up, man? You here to tell me how you abandoned me, bro? What's up, man? As an imposter, I really got you guys on my side. 
Spotify, thank you for gifting a sub to Tim, who's abandoned this stream and no longer cares for it. I appreciate it. <laughs> Tim, welcome back. 27 months. Tim! Tim, you're never here. Don't fucking cap. No cap, Tim. You're never here. I hung out with Tim once in real life, and ever since then, he just stopped going to my stream. I should probably literally can't unmod you because I don't have, like, no mods left. True. Ever since Tim left me. <laughs> <laughs> Active? Yeah, I have a couple mods that haven't been in this bitch in fucking months. Like Tim. <laughs> Tim thinks the 29 months, buddy. Hey, man, hope marbles are doing good. Dropping by like I do every night. LOL. <laughs> Tim, we were talking about you earlier and how you're so here so often. You dumb, stupid bitch, Tim64. You dumb, stupid bitch, Tim64. You dumb, stupid bitch, Tim64. Okay. L what is up with this level of Sag farming? To be clear, I I actually credit past Ludwig for bullying Tim into showing up in stream more often. <laughs> I actually think I met Tim. He stopped showing up to the stream. And then I said that like 18 times as shown here. And then I bullied him into coming back. And then Subathon is when Tim started rearing his, his head back in this bitch. I'm straight up right. I actually bullied Tim into watching me all the time. Had the Subathon not happened and I had not bullied him, Tim would not be here. The and this the old is called Ludwig. Tim. <laughs> yeah. that, that, boys, that's how you gaslight. That's how you gatekeep. And that's how you girl boss. Get destroyed, Tim. Welcome back, baby. Context. Ludwig mods are so paranoid. When Ludwig has a link titled layoff in his bookmarks. <laughs> you guys think I have a bookmark called layoff? And then all it's just people I want to fire? I've, the link is this. It's called lay off because anytime someone is rude to women, I'll play this to lay off. Anyway, upvote, upvote for Tim. Guys, don't pity Tim. He gets paid now. All right, Tim's. Oh, hey, here's my new one. Tim's only here because he gets paid. <laughs> Everybody knows Tim's only here because he gets paid. Actually, speaking of only here because they get paid, a lot of people reached out to me when I had uh, announced that I had COVID. A lot of people were super sweet. They were like, hey, man, hope you get better. And I honestly felt fine. So I didn't feel like it was necessary because I'm vaccinated and I'm, I'm pretty young and healthy. So in general, the illness was not that bad. But I get a DM from my one of my oldest moderators and chatters luda and he says to me hey man hope you feel better to stream by thursday bro thoughts and prayers because thursday is pay the mods thursday where i try to raise money for the mods that's all he sent me that's so fucked He's so fucked. He's a fucking loony, dude. He's an uncaged loony. Look, man, I'm just thoughtful. Fuck you, Luda. Can't believe Ludwig is pregnant. It literally says COVID-19, but yeah, fair enough. Go off. Really evident after today's stream. Ludwig, big book. Ludwig without auto, small book. Uh, you know what? I'm down. Hey, a great man does not um, uh, have greatness thrust upon him. He hires someone. <laughs> Genius, five head. Watching auto stream before Ludwig was insane. Auto had an insanely tight schedule and still had to use most of the time to decipher occasional Ludwig messages on the podcast. They keep talking about Ludwig's problem with communication, but watching it live with a deadline is insane. Auto's still great for doing everything he did in that time. 
Okay, all right. Before I get into this auto apologist era, this assignment was due by the 30th and it got delayed because I just didn't hear from Otto in any way, shape, or form. And also, Otto is dumb. Can I start this trend of Otto is dumb? So we were working with a company uh, and the company was uh, was called Give Butter. It's a charity organization. And I know the founder. I know them. That's why I decided to use them is because I know the founder. And I, and I called him up and I was like, hey, can we use your website for this? And they was like, yeah, for sure. And I was like, Otto, hey, I know this dude. If you need anything, here's his email. Let me know. We can get anything done. He's like, cool. Sounds great, Ludwig. The day before uh, I hit up the founder, his name's Max, and I'm talking to him. And he's like, hey, man, by the way, um, I'm watching Otto's stream, and he's using our regular help portal. And, like, we're just watching it, and, and we're just fixing it. But, like, I don't know. He could just reach out to us and, like, get around it all. <laughs> And I was like, yeah, he should probably do that. But Otto was using like the main help support tool while the founder of the website was watching his stream. Like, what the fuck is this dude doing? <laughs> he Otto is big brain, but he also <laughs> is so dumb. He had the founder on the line and he's like, nah, man, I'll go through the help portal. And then the founder himself was like, uh, what's going on here, bro? <laughs> what are we doing? Anyway, Pog. By the way, big things coming for the extension. Nothing to be announced yet, but big things coming for the extension. You may want to fix this. Watch me live, twitch.tv forward slash Ludwig. Wait, what do you mean? Why would I fix it? Hold up. If I go to twitch.tv forward slash Ludwig. I mean, seems good to me. I mean, seems good to me. <laughs> I mean, shit gets it done, baby. I, well, what's wrong with that, baby? It feels like it works. Feels like it works. <laughs> I don't see what needs fixing. Feels like it's already working. Now that is just unfortunate. Okay, I saw this and this is terrible. This is, let me tell you, one of those terrible things of YouTube. Now the title for this YouTube video is why Ludwig's mom hates Nick because Nick got COVID and then my mom got COVID shortly afterwards. This is what YouTube shortened it to. Which is crazy. Anyway, moving on. Why would you use that picture of your mom? I mean, I didn't. I Nick picked that one, but then I gave him another picture and we changed it. We changed it, so it's this picture now where she looks quite lovely. Uh, I miss the old, and then it's you being mad that promo code tall doesn't work. Um, we got rid of promo code tall in the last one. Uh, I'm pretty sure, but promo code short still worked, which took uh, a cent off. But now neither work. But yeah, we got rid of it in the in the last one. Um, but it is still gone. Twenty eight dollars shipping. Uh, yeah, that's where I make all my money. <laughs> Is by absolutely pounding you guys at shipping. I go to the post office and it costs me $3. But then I charge an extra $25 premium. Call it corporate greed. Call it what you want. I call it mogul moves. It's mogul moves, alright? Okay, bitches. Okay, just say you're broke and move on. I don't need to have all this pity. $60 for a beanie. If you can't afford it, then don't get it. It's mogul moves. 
You're not going to get pity here. Zero pity here, baby. Uh, but yeah, shipping prices are exorbitant. Yeah, but the good thing is they will arrive pretty shortly. I think a lot of the main problem I have with almost all streamer merch is usually how long it takes to arrive. Because like, I don't know. Sometimes I'll order someone's merch and then it, it like I'll forget I ordered it. And then it's like a present because I'm like, oh, my God, I forgot about this six months ago. And I think these all should arrive within a month, which is pog. $30 shipping, it better be hand delivered to you. Uh, $30 shipping? Oh my god, that's so exorbitant. Oh, wait, Amazon treats its workers poorly. Shouldn't they give everybody raises? What the heck? Oh, it's not here in two days? Fucking kill yourself. <laughs> no, but workers have the right to unionize. I think they should unionize to get a higher pay. But not if it means that I'm not going to get free shipping in two fucking days. You fucking idiots. Where's my product? I want it now. Pick one. Pick one. Hey, make fun of my shipping, but then write comma and then fuck all workers. And then I'm down. Speak your truth. Just pick one. It's got to be one. You can't get mad at me for not having Amazon shipping and prices. If you also want workers to have good pay, you can't have both. I'm sorry. If you know, you know. Good morning, sunshine. Thumbnails, ideas, inspiration. This <laughs> is small ant. Small, small cow. He is getting thoroughly milked out there. I won't lie. He's getting thoroughly milked. I mean, like really just cranked to the bone. Look, here's the thing. You guys like to say that I steal ideas from Small Ant. I don't steal any ideas from Small Ant. And I can prove it. Because to steal ideas from Small Ant, I have to be good at video games. There's almost zero Small Ant videos that I could personally accomplish. <laughs> like, hey, I'm down for you guys to pretend that I steal it. But I'm not playing Breath of the Wild. I can't do Mario Odyssey. I'm not doing speed runs of any fucking Pokemon game. Are you telling me, dead ass, you think I can do a zero hit Pokemon run? You're telling me I can do a shiny only Pokemon run. Well, no, I wouldn't go that far. It's just one thumbnail bucket that I'm milking out here. The rest, I, I wouldn't even dream of touching. I wouldn't dream it. You could do the shiny only run? No, I, I wouldn't want to. I think that sounds miserable. I miss the old Ludwig, in quotes. I miss the old, I miss old blank. You know, legit everything you like from whatever time period, interviews, photos, videos, and most importantly, music is still legit available. Haha, <laughs> how you miss something that you can access at any moment, you dumb. <laughs> good one, good one, Tyler, the creator. A fantastic point. Uh, you know what? I, I actually came to the realization that uh, people who are, um, I miss the old whatever, usually it says more about them because what they miss isn't necessarily the old content, but the nostalgia, how they feel watching those videos and how their life was when they used to watch the content, whether it's music or movies or or a streamer, or a YouTuber, it's more like, hey, I missed that 18 months ago, that period of my life, where things seemed so much simpler, based off of my life now, and then instead of, like, acknowledging that, it's more like, and the creator has changed, but usually, I think it's the people's lives have changed, and you like to go back to the simpler time, where it was just, you know, binge-watching videos all day, and I, th I think that happens a lot, you know, like, I, like, cause I'll say, you know, in my head, I'll be like, man, I miss the old call of duty YouTube, but I, 
it's out there. Like old Call of Duty style Modern Warfare 2 commentary exists still. It's just boring as fuck. I don't miss it, but I miss being in high school and watching it after school every day. Anyway. Up up next. Beep, 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 beep. Uh, Ludwig, what happened? This video contains content from TV Tokyo Corporation, who has it blocked on copyright grounds. Yeah, I think it got blocked for playing... Actually, I can find out. Let's find out. Beep, 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 beep. It got blocked for playing... The Naruto theme song is what it was. The Naruto theme song blocked it um, from being played. So I just, I need to avoid playing that. Easy enough. I will not play it again. I will not play it again. Stop getting banned. I'm going to try to get things uh, removed less. Uh, I think there are more VOD frogs because the VODs are easier to access on YouTube than Twitch. Because on Twitch, usually they would just mute the portion of the VOD, but for whatever reason, sometimes they just remove the VOD as a whole on YouTube. And I think there are more VOD frogs. So even though we end up uploading it usually within 24 hours, although I know this one took longer because um, I, I took a while to upload it on the, uh, on the VOD channel, I'll just try to play less copyright and shit. Although, look at this controversial thread. I don't want to sound like a complainer, but I'm starting to not like this car. Accurate. And he's stuck in it for two years? Major L. This comment thread got in Ludwig's last video. Also, he got COVID. <laughs> yeah, you guys are fucking annoying as shit. <laughs> this, it actually feels like the kids gathered around the table, and it's the Fortnite one. And it's the nerdy glass emoji, and it's like, has Ludwig taken too big of an L this time? <laughs> what do you want from me? I'm reading fucking Redditor's comments. Sorry, sorry I'm in the hellhole that I have to read Redditor's comments. Uh, not to say that there are not problems. That's not the point. There are certainly problems that come with YouTube. But if your problem is that, oh, the VOD was taken down and I cannot watch the VOD until it is available 24 hours later, I feel like that is not a, an overwhelmingly terrible problem. But all things considered, I'll I have it uh, I have it in my mind, so I'll avoid playing the copyrighted shit that will remove it. Because I think it was just that one single Naruto theme song. Going to YouTube is a VOD frog's worst nightmare. It's very true. It's why most streamers have VOD channels. Not sure about Lud though. I literally have one. Good. I hate this OP. You're a dumb as bricks, Cat Massacre YouTube. You're a dumb motherfucker. <laughs> I I have a VOD channel. I've had one for months. Why'd you even... You didn't even know I had a VOD channel. Anyway, down vote. Next. I have one for like six months. It does phenomenal. Only the real VOD frogs know about the, the VOD exclusive Super Auto Pets videos. And to you, I salute you. Uh, any chance I get a new sticker? Uh, what happened to your sticker? Wait, what's wrong with it? It's right there. I don't see what's wrong with it. Am I crazy? <laughs> I mean, the sticker seems fine, right? It's just the front of the car. <laughs> you know? You can just, like, cut around. I mean, like, obviously an oil change is probably needed. I don't, I don't know, man. Sticker seems good. <laughs> sticker seems like it'd be good here. Uh, yeah, we don't have stickers at the moments. We don't have stickers at the moment, but, you know, I'll try to get them soon. Uh, <laughs> hopefully you're doing better, brother. That does not look like the uh, the most um, pleasant experience to go through. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah. Just before it gets crushed in the in the in the car garage or whatever, just grab that sticker off of it. Also, feel free if you want to make yourself a sticker. Don't sell it, obviously, but you know. I have no plans to make one. You can probably make yourself one quicker than if I made one and then got you one. I don't because I don't have any lying around, if that makes sense. Uh, you've changed. And then it's promo code tall not working. To be clear, promo code tall didn't work in the last drop. So fake fan is all I have to reply to you. Although I wish, you know, if you put promo code short, then I'd be like, oh, that's a real fan. Because promo code short did exist in the last drop. Promo code tall did not, but whatever. Okay, hey, I'm the only one that knows it, I guess. I got cutie I hate it here merch. I wish there was more talk for the cream. Liked it so much. Dude, at least should have waited a couple months to repost this so no one could remember. It's only been four days. Uh, yeah, it, it was uploaded twice. Okay, but $30 for a beanie. Sheesh. I don't agree with the price. There's a ton for a beanie, but it was produced. It might be produced in the U.S., hence high price. I think, yeah, all the blanks were from U.S. Look, I mean, what do you want from me, guys? What do you want from me? I'm not here to fucking charity give you shit. It's mogul moves. I'm trying to gouge you for all you have. But also... If you waltz into a Zoomies and you get, like, one of those $80, $85 sweatshirts, it ain't that cheap either, you know? Like, hey, you're paying for the mogul here, not just the move. Uh, oh, mods, can we add a new emote, by the way? It's called Marge. I don't think it's that one. I think there's another one. Yeah, this one. This one's better. Marge. This Marge emote is fire. Uh, but anyway, every time I do a merch drop, there's always some concerns with pricing and all that stuff, which I totally understand. And if it's out of your price wheelhouse, that's totally okay. And uh, I have no problems with that in any way, shape, or form. And I would say, don't get it. Don't get it, and that's all right. But if $50 with all shipping, tax, and whatever is, is something that is not a big deal to you and you want uh, the, something from the stream, then uh, go ahead and cop it. I think we've almost completely sold out of the jackets. We are like 90% sold out of the sweatshirts, but we have way too many extra smalls, smalls, and mediums. And then we have like maybe a few hundred beanies left. Uh, and then when it's gone, it's gone forever. And I think all the cutie stuff is gone. Uh, and some of the cutie stuff looked fire, but it's all gone. Yeah, I, we had a bad size distribution. We should have had way more larger sizing, but does it fit true to size? I think it fits a little bigger than usual, but I, I rock the medium for the sweatshirt. You know you're watching too much Ludwig and you start smiling like him. <laughs> it's, not always, it's, not, it's a laugh more than a smile. The bigger problem is that you talk to bears in real life. Anyway, upvote. It's not 0.5% female viewership, by the way. It's much higher. Average Ludwig and Ms. viewers. Siblings, 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 siblings. This is my sister. This is my brother. We are siblings and we care for each other. Everything we own, we always share. Because we are siblings and we have the same hair. Oh, God. Jesus. If I have to watch that, then Ms. Kiff also has to watch that. I think it's only fair. Not bad. You're just being a big bitch. What is this? That it makes me feel uncomfortable. God forbid you go anywhere outside your comfort zone. How about you go outside your comfort zone and let me eat that booty? <laughs> I'll shit in your mouth. All right, I sent it on Discord. I'll watch it eventually. I I'll go next. We've been replaced. 
when Ludwig calls YouTube offline chat pre-chat, Ludwig Twitch pre-chat, I don't want to play with you anymore. <laughs> we are post-chat now, Sag. Imagine holding on to Twitch chat copium. It ain't about the website. It's about where the most convenient place to chat is. Lots of chatters and pre-chatters on Twitch use Chatterino, which is a pop-out chat you can access anytime with having to load Twitch at all. Uh, yada, 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 yada. Old pre-chat, yada, yada, yada. Uh, yeah, yeah, look, hey. I understand, and I actually think it makes total sense that a community is formed around the original pre-chat on Twitch. Having said that all, there are, there are, okay, some of them are fucking psychos out there, okay? we can't, <laughs> so, uh, Some of you guys out there on Twitch are slightly too attached to it. I'm going to say it. Slightly. You could have moved on to a Discord. All right, there's a... The moment I realized, I was like, this has gone too far, was when somebody reached out because an emote had been removed on Twitch after I got uh, uh, a U the, uh, the YouTube switch. This is not... This is not my view. This is my sister. This is my brother. We are siblings and we care for each other. Everything we own, we always share. Because we are siblings and we have the same hair. Oh my fucking god, dude. Mom's watching, bro. <laughs> oh shit. Yo, Nick. <laughs> is this the guy? Wait. Is he the one that thinks the sexualizing siblings thing is weird? <laughs> no. Mizkif? <laughs> no. What? <laughs> he thinks it's weird? Come on. I miss the old Ludwig. A real talk Sayori is a complete unit all around top thought. Is this Sayori from what's that? <laughs> from uh, Doki Doki Literature Club? D Doki Doki Literature Club is not weeb. All right. That is an American-made show, okay? That's, that's American to the core, all right? Sorry I like American-made games with American-made values. You guys talking about weeb shit. I like shit grown in this country, born in my soil, around my neck of the woods. Y'all worried about what's happening in Nippon Des? I'm worried about wh what's happening at home. Better understand Des, Okay? It's American made. God damn it. Fuck that weeb shit. Two years of painting the short guy. January 8th, 2020. January 8th, 2022. You know what? This is the first time in writing I have realized that it's 2022. And that was quite uh, scary to find out. But anyway, good job. Good progress. Looks great. Upvote. Hard and frustrating platformer I made. Would love to see Ludwig try this. Control the goat. Fall over and over again. Reach the top. Bouncy goat climb. That looks cute. That's a cute little goat. That's a cute game. No shot I play it. <laughs> but upvote cute game. Maybe someone else in chat will play it. <laughs> not, not me. Ain't gonna be me. Fuck no. I just did the Jump King challenge. And I have... Chat, I have... Chat, stop giving me a hard time. Because I have five days until this comes out. Somewhere far out into the ocean, there is an island. A mysterious place that can only be reached. From space.
Chat, that comes out. Not so fast. Oh, no. I'm Minifold. This comes out literally four days from now. January 15th. And when it comes out, we're going to do a Pogo Stuckathon. What date is the 15th? How soon is that? Saturday? All right, Saturday. So Saturday, I'm going to go live at like noon. And I'm going to stay live until I beat the game. Whether it takes me a day, two days, or like three days. How long do you think it'll take me to beat the game? Because like if you put it in raw hours, I think Pogo Stuck 2 took me like 50 hours of gameplay. But I could do 50 hours of gameplay in like four days. Five days maybe. I honestly, and maybe I think, maybe I'm crazy. I think I do this in two days. I literally think I will be done by Monday. I'm going to go live Saturday. I'm going to play all day. I'm going to be cracked. I'm just a better gamer than I used to be. And my stream will be over by Monday. I also have a brand new cars bed. We got a new cars bed on Amazon for, I think, our Amazon stream we did the other day. So I do have a new cars bed. It's jet black. We're going Venom on this bitch. Cutie gonna be a widow? Bro, I literally won't play. It won't take me as long as any. All I have to do all day is play Pogo Sug. Like, that's easy. That's free. The Pogo Thon. I, I think I'll beat it in like two, three days. I actually think I'm just better at the game now. Because it's not supposed to be as hard as the second one. And the second one was way harder than the first one. So if it's not even as hard as the second, I think I'll crush it. We'll see. I guess we'll see. I will say this is what Stance has been doing. Stream finishes when I or stream ends when I finish building the eight hundred dollar Millennium Lego uh, Millennium Falcon Lego set. Dude, Stans is gonna be live for like two days straight, three days straight doing this. He's been live for five hours and forty three minutes. The world record, like the world record by a champion Lego set builder, is sixteen hours to complete this Lego set. So if that's like a pro, if a pro does it in 16 hours, it's going to take stands like two, three days best. Sag, me getting over a thousand updutes. Me when Ludwig d does not do a Reddit recap. I got you. Hey, updute, man. Maya straight flexing better immunity system than Ludwig. Tested positive for COVID. I got it at the same time as Eamon. It might have been from rock climbing, but unsure. Maya posted her. <laughs> Dude, I saw this. I saw this and I was like, that fucking bitch. <laughs> I did a COVID test. I wake up after a terrible night and I read my Twitter and it's Maya smiley facing her negative COVID test. <laughs> that son of a bitch okay well she didn't go rock climbing like me huh that's right nobody rock climbs quite like me no more bull <laughs> wrong Ludwig I made a Mogul Moves live wallpaper. You weeb, dude. Oh, Pog. You weeb, though. All right, let's check by month in case I missed anything from over a week ago. I the found Ludwig Tim, at the Cowboys yeah, Tim, game. Tim used to clip everything that ever happened on my stream ever. What the hell? And then I met. 
I found Ludwig at the Cowboys game. I found Ludwig at the Cowboys game. <laughs> That's so creepy. <laughs> That's so creepy, dude. What the fuck? Holy shit. Holy shit. What the fuck? <laughs> That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. No mask, yikes. I'm in fucking Texas. If you get a mask and then you go to order a Bud Light, they call you a pussy and they tell you to get the fuck out. <laughs> You're not allowed to have a mask in Texas. Sit up. <laughs> okay, how about you eat shit? Chat, if, okay, right now, if there was a camera on you, I bet you guys would all look like the most disgusting, hobbled over creature. Right now, you guys are all probably in your room, just like hobbled over your desk. On your second monitor, I'm sitting there. On your first monitor is like Super Auto Pets or some homework. All right, on your third monitor is like your iMessage, and yeah, she hasn't responded yet. Stop glancing over there. Okay, get over it, bro. She's not going to reply to your Discord notif. Oh, wait, she will. Just fucking kidding. That was still me. That was still me. That was still me. Still no one there. It's me, bitch. It's me. Now work on your posture. <laughs> All right, baby. That is insane, though. That's insane. There's a camera that does that. I actually got one. He's a hero. For anyone that doesn't know, they have this at every game in the AT&T Stadium. I was there for the Cotton Bowl in 2015. And it's still have a photo from the giant camera. You can zoom in. It's kind of absurd. It's insane. I work security. They have higher tech cams for that. <laughs> That's crazy, actually. Yeah. That is terrifying to hear. This camera, if you ever thought you could get away with cheating at a casino, imagine this camera, but at a casino, but way better. Like, they probably have 10 times this at a casino whenever you're gambling. They go to, like, table four, zoom, enhance, zoom. It's so HD. That's crazy, man. Come on, Lud. <laughs> no, you can't. There's, there's subtle differences. There's subtle differences amongst all of them. You can't appreciate the subtle differences when you're too deep into it. It's it, hey, to be fair, it is a good face. You know? It's a it's a good face. He is he do be laughing pretty hard. When you make a good reaction face, you got to get some mileage. That's what I'm saying. You make a good face, you get some mileage out of it. All right? Man, I love Lud, and I know this shit's normal for YouTube, but lately I've been clicking less and less on his videos because of how clickbaity they've been. Thank God someone said it. I feel the same exact way. Hey, I'm down for you guys to think this. Views are up 50%. Don't care. Plus ratio. Plus you're white. Plus you like One Piece, which is cringe. <laughs> I have learned the art. Of the YouTube. And that is. That the face does not fucking matter at all. Look at this. Look the past seven videos are all the same exact face.
The past eight. Past nine of ten. It's actually insane that that's how it works, though, you know? When you get a good face, you get a good face. All right, not much to say, man. Not much to say about it. Notice the decrease in his viewers, though. Uh, I, I, I kind of see what you're saying if you look at the past five. But if you look at the past five, that's ignoring the fact that this a face was originally posted all the way back... I mean, this face has been posted for literal months. This is a year-old face. He made this face a year ago, and he got 44 million views, then he got 26 million views. It's almost like it's not the face that matters. It's not really clickbaity. It just feels low effort to reuse a face 10 times. Do you know why Ludwig stopped making a new face for every video? Here you go. <laughs> Holy shit. Wait, wait, is this my alt account? What's going on here? It's actually even less interesting than that. The, the reason I will sometimes use a different face is because I will make a thumbnail on a different computer or one of my editors will make a thumbnail. And if I'm not at my stream setup, I have no way to capture my face. And so I will just reuse a face from a different thumbnail. That's the only reason. So like all the ones with TikTok in it, Polite made the thumbnail. And so he pulled a face from a different thumbnail. Beep, 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 beep. You see, it works because he's short and he has a chest hole. Ludwig, bottom text. <laughs> Will it ever be the same again? Me not being able to put up with YouTube chat since the move. Me still tuning into Lud to allow him to beat Lo-Fi Girl. That's all I ask. That's all I ask in this world. If only there's a way to enjoy Twitch chat and the YouTube stream, though, you know? That'd be crazy. <laughs> That'd be crazy. Can't imagine. Where is Cutie's cat? Lud, can you get me a cat? We have a cat at home. Cat at home. And it's myself again. <laughs> That's not what happens. Shameless. This was a shameless deal. Ludwig and my friend running together holding hands in their high school. <laughs> yes, this is a picture of me when I was 17 in high school. Holding hands. And we were running with your friend probably went to University of Redlands, which is where I think Eric went. So true, so true. All right, that's the end of the Reddit recap, boys. It's about enough Reddit recapping for, for my taste for one day. And let's get to some better things to react to, you know? There's some greater things in the universe, like unusual memes. Any unusual memers? Any TikTok timers? Uh. Wait, what? says map two is fucking ridiculous and then he says it'll take you 100 hours minimum but best of luck heart first of all what psychopath says that and then goes but good luck like what do you what is this a hundred fucking hours of my life but i saw this dm and i scoffed in fact this was me the first day it came out i'm not so foolish are you saying that I said the second pogo stuck, I was overconfident, and now I'm going to be overconfident on the third pogo stuck, and I'm going to get fucked? Do you guys actually think I'm going to get rolled in pogo stuck? Chat, you're so dumb. 
You're dumb as bricks, chat. Last time, the creator of Pogo Stuck, Superku, DM me and said the game would take me 100 hours to beat and that it's ridiculous. This time, he DM me and he said, I think you could beat it in eight hours. So, like, if he thought it'd take me 100 hours last time and it took me 50, and he says eight this time, I'll beat this in four hours. Like, this is literally going to be one day of my life. I'm going to beat this in a couple hours and move on. He's not lying to me. He's not lying to me to, to, to make me feel... No, 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 no. He's not lying to me to get me to be overconfident. That's that's totally false. I resent every single sentence that says that. I think you guys just don't believe that I'm good at Pogo Suck. I think you guys just forget I'm good at games. Are you guys forgetting that if you go to Jump King Speedrun, that I am technically the 19th person in the world to beat all three games in under an hour. Only 18 other people have done that. So you're the worst? No. <laughs> No, I'm not the I'm not the worst. I'm the only American on this list. Okay? I'm swimming in a sea of Japanese speedrunners and one goddamn American holding it down. I'm like Rocky. Miz could do it. There's no universe. Miz could beat all three Jump Kings in under an hour if he tried right now. There's no universe. He would have Emmy sit right next to him. He tried doing the first one. He'd fall a couple times. He'd freak out. He'd boot up some League of Legends. Call it a day. Did you even beat getting over Ludwig? Oh my god. You guys just stay talking shit. You guys just stay talking that shit. Miz didn't even beat the second Pogo Stuck. Beat Pogo Stuck 2 right now? Okay, you know what? You know, I might. I might. I might. You know, I might. I might. I might just. Four hours or what, big fella? Do you want to make a wager? Okay, well, no. I was more so... I, I don't want to bet on it. I'm not, like, that confident in four hours. I'm just thinking, like, around, like... All I'm saying is there's no way I go above 48 hours. There's no way I go, I'll go above 48 hours in the Pogothon. Cole, thank you the two months, man. Hope you're feeling better. It's not going to take me a week minimum. Dude, you guys are, you guys, you guys are something else. You guys are something else. All right, let's take a look at TikTok time, everybody. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, feels good to watch unusual memes again. Some sweet, unusual memes to take my mind off of having COVID-19. Memes that, uh, unusual memes that will make you forget you have COVID-19. Unusual memes that will make you forget the world is in the middle of a pandemic. Mm. Unusual memes that will make you haha -ha, laugh and lamau. Okay, everybody has been dogging me because every TikTok time I use the same thumbnail face. So let's get a new one right now. Ready? This is my new one. <laughs> is that better okay now it's a little higher effort now it's a new face a new face you were here for it brand new face don't say i wouldn't use those those are some good faces in there they're not my vinegar strokes that's not 
Dude, no one uses that term anymore, by the way. All right, let's get to it. It's TikTok time, everybody. Unusual memes compilation 171. Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh. <laughs> What was that transition? <laughs> Did they do a whip cut? God damn. Unusual memes has upgraded their editing. <laughs> Everybody pog new Ludwig face just dropped. I have been doing the same three faces. I've gotten me through a lot. By the way, is our new emote live? Is Marge live? Are chatters now able to freely Marge? Oh, Marge is now live. Dude, this is the greatest emote. Marge in the chat. I mean, don't Marge right now because there's nothing to be Marge at, but, you know, keep it in your back pocket. Honey, wake up. New loving face just dropped. That's pretty paint. Yeah, you nailed it, bro. Oh, oh, oh. First ice cream of the new year. Oh my gosh, that's perfect. That's wow. Huge. Huge. <laughs> Be carefully, he's a hero. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, <laughs> uh, dude, bald people are just funnier. They're, it's like people with accents. They're just funnier. That's half of Slime's funny at power. I think he's upgraded. I think it's upgraded him. Ever since Slime became bald, it's like post time skip Slime. <laughs> he's gained new powers of funny and comedy. <laughs> Oh, oh my god! <gasps> oh, oh damn! Oh my god! Oh, that is tough. He broke through the plastic piece that goes above the filter that you're supposed to clean out. <laughs> oh, that's sad, bro. It also could be inspirational. This could be the turning point. Nice one, Sully. What did that shirt say? Play in reading, in coloring, and spelling, in art, in friends. So true. Oh, oh he run! He run! Get his ass! Get his ass! <laughs> Dude, I went to Subway the other day. I, are there any Subway workers here or former Subway workers here? Do they do this thing where they fucking lie to your face? Because I went to a Subway uh, on... Uh, no, excuse me. It was a Jimmy John's. I went to a Jimmy John's. So now I, I no, I don't. Sorry to. I didn't mean to call out the artists of the world. Please stand back. Stand by. But any Jimmy John's employees. I went to Jimmy John's because Nick wanted to go. And when I walked in, they said, hey, we do not have any rolls. We only have wheat bread. And they made it sound extra cringe. Like they put stank on it. They, they're like, we only have wheat. And I was like, "Ugh, that sucks. But whatever, I'm really hungry. So me and Nick decided to stay there. But they had giant, giant containers with rolls, like, within eye shot. I could see them. I saw containers with rolls. And I was like, 
I didn't ask because socially I felt weird about it because they told me that they didn't have it. But I'm like, I see the fucking rolls. They're there. Why do I see the rolls? Why did they lie to me? Because they didn't want to make it. Did they lie to me so I would leave the store? It was old. Oh, yeah. Like, I'm really worried about the age of the products when I go to Jimmy John's. I mean, let's just keep it a stack. I don't care. <laughs> I, th I assumed at least 25% of everything I ate was expired when I walked into the store. It's kind of how it goes when you walk into a Jimmy John's. I thought it was kind of like, because this has happened to Slime a few times. It has happened to me before. But when we go to a certain McDonald's drive through uh, if it's late at night, the, the night shift, if you go through the drive through they do this. Hey, it's cash only. And I always walk around with a shit ton of cash in my car. And so I'm like, oh, no problem. And then they're always like, all right, what do you want? I get, what do you want? I guess if you have cash, like we can't really do much. But I swear to God, they just lie about the system being shut off so that people will just leave. I got cash on me, man. Who, who are you? Hello. Booba? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> that was so rude. That was the meanest thing I've ever seen. She stopped and then flipped the camera around to film him. Oh, that's insane. He deserved it. He was out of pocket. Here's a Weber gas, gas, gas grill. It can go anywhere. Not there. Yo, what the... Is this... What the fuck? That's actually genius. It's so your arm is like a perfect barrel that lines up with where you're shooting because normally it like arches up. That's genius. What the fuck? Um, you just throw it at the wall and see if it sticks. He's gonna throw it up. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my. Wait, they didn't want it to fall? Then why the fuck did you film it and stare at it as it was falling? <laughs> oh, they're probably upset about all the tools. I get it. She's actually making a snowball. That is hilarious. <laughs> Okay, don't make fun of the guy because that's me every time I hit the go live button. I'm a 26 year old man and I hop on this bitch and I'm like, no shot, guys, no cap on God, straight up, guys, straight up, fellas. <laughs> Can I get an amen on God for real, though? Ma I know you're making fun Mom of said she can't get the air fryer to go past 350. <laughs> no, man. The cat dead, man. Nigga DOA the cat, man. No. Oh, there they go! <laughs> oh. Knocked him out! Oh. One man allegedly went too far when he was told his Little Caesars pizza was not hot and ready. Pulling an AK-47. <laughs> 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 
It's a valid response. Their whole thing is hot and ready, so if it was neither hot nor ready, you pull out the AK. Three car pilot because of this fucking what is this asshole, asshole What is this asshole doing? Dude, move your Go. fucking car. You gotta put your hazards Literally, on, buddy. You're not even <laughs> Put your hazards on, Two man. Two hour parking. Yeah, I <laughs> I hated that. Man, the line one almost worked. <laughs> Up on the 10 pin, Chris Vies is feeding it out to that 454 down lane. And look at this pin action. Oh. <laughs> and look at this pin action. Oh. Uh, dude, I want to be that into a sport. You're coming at just a pin falling over? That's amazing. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Oh my god. I haven't had a chance to just chill. This video is chaotic. Oh, no. <laughs> oh god damn it. Damn, what do you do in this spot? Me and Cutie found a cat once when we were getting gas at 11.30 p.m. in a bush right next to the gas station. She tried for an hour to try to get the cat to bring it home. But the cat kept running away. Wait, this is Universal Studios, the basketball challenge. This is actually really hard because not only is it longer than a three-pointer, I think the hoops are also smaller than a basketball hoop. Oh, you got 30 seconds on the clock. Oh. <laughs> That's a new level of shit, though. <laughs> okay. Impressive strength to throw it over. Oh, fuck! <sighs> who, who got got, chat? Come clean. Who got got? Let, let's just, let's just admit it now. You're a bigger man if you admit getting got than if you'd never got got at all. I got got Marge Marge at the video. All right. And the creator of the video for trying to get us. I'm, I'm a perennial flincher. <laughs> All right. One more video. Let's go. Wait, that jacket's actually kind of fire though. The tied jacket. <laughs> what? Let's fucking go! How did she make it like that? Damn it. Assistance is on the way. No, that's not how you put your drink down. <laughs> Alright, I saved it. Oh. 
this this is just a series of things and I, it's like they can't get worse and it keeps getting worse everything just keeps getting worse it's only been 53 seconds i feel i've been i've, I've been watching like 30 minutes of video clips it just keeps getting worse getting pickled is a fate worse than death i mean you would stink of pickle for years <laughs> <laughs> That's some first aid energy. <laughs> Damn, that is so much better than him being a chatted and pulling it down slowly. <laughs> Fuck tall people. Fuck tall people. I've always said that. Get owned, tall fuck. Here he is, look. Jamie the Wonder Kid. Oh, God. No. No, dude. I didn't think it was his head. Oh no! <laughs> I like these new boobs. <laughs> <laughs> we don't deserve life. <laughs> It just as it, as humanity, I feel like we get so much. Like, you know, 500 years ago, your lifespan was like 40 years old. You would have 12 kids. Three of them would make it out of childhood. Like three of them. The rest would fucking die to like insane illness. No modern medicine practices. Running water doesn't exist. You shit into a corner in your house. And still you fight through. You fight through to continue your line. You're humans. Your last name comes from the people before you who fought in war. All right? To make you come out. And then this is what we do. We lose to a cabinet door that we bought. A Viking conquered just... Dozens and thousands of acres of land for this guy to open this fucking bar on his gamer computer laptop, whatever. Oh, crumbs everywhere bar. Oh, it's a mini cab. My favorite car. Ooh, cool. <laughs> Are they Nightcore, the Nightcore version of that song? They made it even faster? What is it called? Caramel Dancing? Yeah. <laughs> you would know that song? I only know because of Nick. All I know about this song is a real quick information break. There's a song called Caramel Dancing. I don't think I'm going to spell it right. Yeah. And uh, and the this is the song that everyone knows by the Carmella girls who are animated girls. Which is not the original, by the way. There is another song also called Caramel Dancing by the band called, uh, like, Caramel. And the band came out with this song. It wasn't that popular. 
Years later, the record label re-released this song by creating Anime Girls. They just made the song faster, and it got super fucking popular. And then the original band got zero money from the new version. <laughs> well, that's the music industry. Oh, dude. I don't get humans. Ooh. being so nice and show them how crazy you are <laughs> slime Zip. oh no Zip. Oh. Oh. oh he really tried <laughs> oh Just ask her out. What's the worst thing what? that could happen? No, don't do this again. Then you open that elevator. Don't do this shit again, I don't know why guys pants each other when they hang out. Or maybe you guys don't do that. You guys can p chime in. We played Mario because my friend Ben was over and Miles was over. We're all playing Mario, and Miles stands up, and I pants him, and I accidentally took off both <laughs> his shorts and his underwear, and he was full dick out, and it was so, in that moment, it was so small, and he was so mad at me. And the rest of the night, he just kept coming up to me, and he kept trying to show me his dick and balls, because he's like, oh, that's what you want to see, isn't it? Oh, that's what you want to see, right? And so he'd keep, he'd keep pulling it out, and like, uh, to get back at me. Look, hey, mine would have been tiny in the moment, too, okay? Look. I mean, with a little bit of booze, it basically retreats up into itself for warmth and safety. <laughs> Why would you say that to 20k people? He's, look, uh, hey, are, are we going to lie about this? That a soft penis is small? Like, why, are, why do we have to pretend? It was a giant, massive anaconda. Are we all going to lie about penises now? Ridiculous. I think this is a safe split space. <laughs> you know what the weirder part is? I found out Josh, one of my Australian friends, has a, a very, very tiny ball. Like, sometimes one ball might be bigger than the other, but one ball was, like, the size of, like, a shriveled-up raisin, and then the other was, like, a large golf ball. Like, one ball was small, and the other was huge. Anyway. <laughs> You're done. You're done. Somebody said you going beast mode on that cereal. Hey. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> this is Hassan on Twitch when React is dead. <laughs> when he can't watch your news or YouTube videos anymore. <laughs> Whoa. That's her mother. Hi. Can I touch you? Oh my oh. God. They can do that? What? That's the most athletic pig I've ever seen. Hey, don't stay here. It's dangerous. Hey, <laughs> wake up. Shake. Koalas are so Shake. fucking Shake. dumb. No, they aren't. Aren't koalas just literally dumb and then they eat eucalyptus, which is the only thing they can eat, and then that is literally like a drug and they get high off of it? One more. I'm down. We got a snowman on the move. His life is in my hands. Oh. No! <laughs> Meow. <laughs> Seeing this one. The thing is... I think I've seen all the unusual memes there are to see. Look how many reds there are. I'd have to go really old. So <laughs> <laughs> that was a fire meme. That's a classic. Are you doing? Oh my. Ba, ha, ba, ba. No! <laughs> I like it without the video. Wait, someone said react to old vines. I wonder if I can find my old vines.
I used to make vines all the time in high school, way before I had any success anywhere online. I had vines. I had a bunch of vines. I used to make them all the time. I, I don't know if they still exist, though. How do you even find them? Because I'm, I'm Googling Ludwig Auger and Vines, but mostly what comes up is me reacting to Vines. I don't know if Wayback Machine works for Vine.com, does it? I'm pretty sure my account name was just Ludwig Augren. It was not the zany sidekick. I would like to find... Oh, wait. Uh, uh, shit, how do we find this chat? The servers are long gone. Is there no, like, Vine archive? I'm using Wayback Machine to try to see it, but I don't know if it'll work. Found it, did you? You're memeing. There's a Vine archive. The cons of the clapper. That's one of them, yeah. Hold up, let me see. How did you guys find this? As of 2019, the full Vine archive is no longer available. <gasps> no. Dude, that's so lame. I'm pretty sure my Vine username was just Ludwig Ogren. Vine dying is sad only because the archive's gone. Isn't it weird one day YouTube will be like Vine and dead and none of the VODs will live for it anymore? Wait, what? Okay, just kidding. Tim found literally all of my old Vines. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Okay, all right. <laughs> hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, this is eight years old, almost nine years old. These are all of my old vines. You know, I never made it big as a vine star. I can admit that. I'm not like a, a vine star turned YouTuber like Logan Paul or Drew Gooden or Jake Paul or somebody else like who made it big. But I did make a lot of vines. That was like the first platform where I actually made some content on and so i think i think it'd be kind of funny to watch these old vines because i will be honest i haven't seen them in years i didn't even know i could still pull them up it's been like five years since i've seen most of these so i figure hey there's six seconds apiece let's take a look at the vines that i made when i was still in high school Sophie. starting with <laughs> oh these are gonna be terrible man so okay let's take a look Sophie. How do you enlarge? Click to enlarge. Doesn't work though. Sophie, roll oh, that over. Works, that works, that works, that works. 
All right, all right, all right, all right. Here it is. Here it is. This is my first vine. This is my first vine all the way back from high school days. Uh, and we'll just we'll just look through them. We'll just look through my old vines, see how I was. How old was I? Eight years ago. I was tw I was eighteen. I can't. I don't even have an excuse. <laughs> I was hoping I'd be like 17, 16, 15 years old. No, if this came out in 2013, I was 18 years old. I was 17. I, I turned 18 this year. All right, let's do it. Sophie, roll over. Good girl. <laughs> Dude, that's, that's comedy. That's comedy. Do you guys get it? It was subtle, but it was it was it was poignant. <laughs> All right, let's try another one. <laughs> stink, stink, stink. <laughs> I need a moment. I need a moment to collect myself. I need a moment to collect myself. Was that me voicing the stink bug? Going stink, stink, stink. That same stink bug voice has now formed into my George Clooney impression. All right. Okay. Ooh. Uh, stink, stink, stink. Ah! Not so smelly anymore. I mean, that's just art. That's art. It's a beginning, it's a middle, it's an end. It's almost like Greek theater in a way. It's the hero's journey. <laughs> you can tell I was a theater kid. Yeah, it's, it, is, it is obvious. But also you can tell that this comedy chap was beginning to bud. All right, so far, no misses. Let's see next one. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what is that? Oh, I can't even make it through six seconds of this. Slut. <laughs> I don't even know. I don't even know what that was meant to be. I think that was me pretending to jerk off after noticing no one was around me. And then I receive a text from my mother saying, you were a mistake. And then I, did I call her? Slut. Slut. I called her a slut. Which bold when I lived under her roof. Insane. All right, let's go next. Oh, it's too far. Okay, here, let's see it. Oh, it's too far. How many views did that get back in the day? Oh, this bad boy? 34 loops. Okay? Eight likes. All right? That's, you know, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. We're talking eight likes here. Isn't this relatable too? Isn't it so true that even if you had the force to pull in a remote, you would still get boomed because the batteries are always missing in the back of the remote? That's true and relatable. Welcome. Welcome, my dog. Mm, smells real nice. Aw, she's peeing. <laughs> she's not the only one. Welcome, my dog. 
<clears throat> Smells real nice. Aw, she's <laughs> peeing. She's not the only one. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. Yo. <laughs> That's just a good vine. <laughs> That's just a good vine out there, man. That's classic comedy. And let me tell you, that was good for 18 likes back in the day. Okay? 18 likes, Drake and chat. Uh, let me make sure this one follows terms of service. <laughs> this one is... This one's going to be so dumb, bro. I'm I'm expecting the worst video here. It starts with a toilet. <laughs> Son of a... <laughs> oh, so true, fellas. So true, fellas. When the toilet paper isn't there, I hate that. I hate that. When you want the toilet paper after you've taken a shit. Ah, oh, so true. Fellas, you know. You know what it's like to shit? <laughs> all right. All right. Let's go next. Just call cutie. Cutie up now. <laughs> hey. Hey, that's that's clean. Giddy up now. That's a clean one right there. I wasn't sitting with my full weight on the dog, all right? Let me tell you, this is going to blow your mind. That was some vine magic. What I actually was doing was walking on my legs, but I had filmed it in a way that made you think that the dog was carrying me. I was a bit of an artist. All right, let's see next. Prom. Prom. Yeah. <laughs> Prom. Yeah. Prom. Hot girls, nice girl, people with boobs, guys, mom, dog. <laughs> Good list, bro. <laughs> That's fire. That's fire. In getting the dog to say no, I mean, that's fire there. We're getting there. Down bad. You know what? I can't lie. I did go to prom by myself, so that one, that one strikes a little too close to home. Because when I made that, I don't think I knew that I would go to prom by myself. <laughs> Someone wrote, this is pretty cringe for back then, by the way. Uh, sounds like you're jealous because I got 36 likes in 94 loops and you have zero vine clout. Do not eat, please. This is for tomorrow. Whoops. <laughs> hey, hey, a little juxtaposition. Oh, you thought I would eat the small piece, but no, in fact, I kept the small piece to leave and i ate the big one that's that's classic that's just classic all right let's see what this one is <laughs> these are hey on a scale of one to ten how great are these <laughs> they hurt the watch if you thought those were bad, you're going to love this one. I remember this one. You know that dumb rumor that men think about sex every six seconds? To be honest, that rumor just isn't... Titties! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> uh, <laughs> while driving too yeah i was dangerous i kept it fast and loose on the road at all times 
<laughs> that one, by the way, that one was got one revine. So, you know. All right. All right. See you later. I got to head out. All right. Love you. <laughs> you know, I probably shouldn't have filmed that. Oh, you've never had a dog lick you on the mouth. Now all of a sudden it's weird. <laughs> wow. All of a sudden calling beta. <laughs> <laughs> these I don't know if I want to watch all these boys. I'm not going to lie. It's getting hard to get through these and I think I remember this period. I started to get a little bit confident here, all right? I started to get a bit of views on these. And I think the confidence might have led to some, you know, even cringier content. I don't know if how to have uh, I don't know if I prepared for these. How to have an orgasm less than 6 seconds. <laughs> I mean, that's the audio. That's the first second of the next video. How to have an orgasm in less than six seconds. How to have an orgasm in less than six seconds. Little that I know, the answer was just have sex. All right, let's see it. How do you have an orgasm in less than six seconds, Ludwig? How to have an orgasm in less than six seconds. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. You know, it's. <laughs> Nutella, you know, it, it's the hazelnut treat that keeps on giving. Oh, my God. All right, let's see it. Next one. Oh, shit. Stacking up bills. Straight out of a stripper's butt crack. Oh, come on, dude. That's the best you got. I bet that wasn't even the first take. I bet it was a few takes to get there. I bet that one took a bit. Oh, my God. Hello. <laughs> That's just that's just beautiful. I love bad bitches, that's my fucking problem. I like to fuck. I got a fucking problem. I mean, that's just angel thump all the way. You could see the musical talent there. Bo Burnham. This is like Bo, if Bo Burnham fell in a vat of acid. <laughs> and could no longer make content. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm scared going through these. I'm genuinely terrified of what's to come. <laughs> uh, all right none of them have been too bad yet you know hi can i order two large pizzas with the side of pussy pussy You know what? I would like to blame the YouTubers at the time for their prank videos. I feel like they were bad examples for the, the youth at the time. If it makes it better, it was my coworker. It was my, I worked there. I'm wearing a t-shirt from my job. I worked there. Any Baconers?
All right, let's see. Okay, this one. Okay, th <laughs> this one is Pornhub, so I don't think I can show that. <laughs> you know that holds up i'm keeping this one this is like cartoon humor this is what you see in a tom and jerry <laughs> this one's fire that's pretty much like half of every yard episode is that an exact interaction Whoa. Oh, well, that was just Pog. That was just Pog Tent. Whoa. That's Pog Tent through and through, dude. Wicked. The flip with the sunset? Whoa. Oh. Okay, this one's called How to Talk to Women. And the like to view ratio is bad. I'm nervous on this one. Hey, you look really nice today. <laughs> this is going to be cringe. This is going to be so cringe. Hey, you look really nice today. Ooh, thank you. It's my grandma's old. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's really cool. <laughs> Good one, bro. <laughs> Talk to them in their breasts. <laughs> hey, you look really nice today. <laughs> Ludwig, why do I have only 5% women who, uh, viewership? Also Ludwig. Ooh, thank you. It's my grandma's old. Yeah, yeah, that's really cool. Good. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Oh, yeah. You know, I you know what, guys? Marge at old Ludwig. That's when you say I miss the old Ludwig, that's who you're talking about. Oh, I okay, this one. This was my most successful vine. It had 247 likes, 202 revines. This went platinum. <laughs> Woo! That's good, bro. The clapper. That's comedy. No, my mom did not record it. No, it was my cousin who recorded it. Okay. All right, let's see. I got a few more. I got a secret man between. No, I'm not watching this one. I'm not watching this one. Cousins weird too. It was a, it was a video. No, I'm not watching it. Cause every time I show you one, you guys chastise me and make fun of me. And I feel like I keep making myself vulnerable only to be attacked for the actions of my past self. And so I don't know if I feel comfortable Especially because the first second sounded like I was rapping. And I don't know if I want to watch it now. I got a secret man between. No, I'm not. I'm not going to do it. I'm not. Because every time I start it, I keep hearing my voice rap. I won't dare. I won't dare. I it's Oh. <clears throat> it's going to be so cringe. 
Watch. All right. All right. Fine. Fine. I'll watch it. In exchange, everybody has to subscribe to my YouTube channel, but I will watch it. I will watch it. I got a secret man between me and you, fella, that whenever I want, I can throw it in cellar. <laughs> Wait. Do you guys hear the background song? I got a secret man between me and you, fella, that whenever I want, I can throw it in Zelda. It's like a rap beat for Zelda. It's like a great fairy fountain rap beat. New React face just dropped. Check it out, boys. New Ludwig React Pog face. Collect them all. Poop. Is this one chill? Does this one have a penis? Okay, no, we're good. Hello? <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> I mean, that's classic. That's classic. That's an all-timer. This is my last ever Vine, and I think the reason why is because it got 100 views and only two likes. And I remember making this in college and then only getting two likes and then being like, Vine is dead to me now. I'll save you. And it was captioned every time I see those dog commercials. So, yeah, you know what? That was a... Hey, I miss the old, old Ludwig Viner. Oh, my God. Someone said cutie behind you. Uh, band kid humor. Uh, yeah, you're actually wrong. It's theater kid humor, and it's slightly different. Although, I, hold up. I missed one. Hold up. Little blacks. We have a... We have a, we have a secret last one, if you guys want to see it. Uh, for some reason, I had an obsession with rapping. I don't remember this phase I ha had. Okay, you know what? Let's actually go back to never watching these ever again. I think you have to have something twisted, sick, and mental in your brain. If you upload videos or content on the internet and then expect people to watch you while there's already too much content on the internet. And you can really see it in full form when you go back to watch these old vines. <sighs> there is something sick and twisted for me to have the hubris to upload these vines. And not only upload these vines, but upload them, stop uploading them, and then now continue to upload YouTube videos after that failed. You gotta have something wrong with you. I, I, I think every streamer and YouTuber is a little bit twisted. <laughs> a little bit twisted in the brain. Uh, boys, we're gonna do a Reddit review. Where we review a uh, great YouTube Reddit, or excuse me, great subreddit. 
It's YouTube re or ready review time, everybody. Uh, but but first, uh, I need a subreddit. So give me a good subreddit. Basically, a subreddit where if we look in the past of one year, you can find a bunch of cool, unique posts. <clears throat> and I got to piss real quick. I'm losing my voice rapidly, though. Alright boys, what's a good subreddit? I need an actually good one though. No, you, I, I, a lot of these are repeats. We've already done dad reflexes. No, 50-50, you guys are actually trying to get me banned. Isn't 50-50 the messed up subreddit that has like literally one of the most... It's like porn and like terrifying shit, right? Where did the soda go? Huh? Where did the soda go? Is this good? Infomercials out of context. Where did the soda go? I've never heard of that. Is that a good one? It seems good. It's listed as just infomercials out of context. Which seems hype and pog enough. All right, yeah, let's try it. I don't mind it. We did do a stream where I let you guys link me ads and then we bought all the greatest ads um, that we could. And we're going to unbox those things in a little bit. But I wouldn't mind watching what spawned that, which is which is terrible infomercials. You know, a lot of you guys probably know that I used to be. I, I, I had a dream of being a, a talk show host. You guys probably remember that or have heard that before. And that's true. But before I dreamed about being a talk show host, I had a brief phase of my life shortly after Billy Mays died where I wanted to be a TV salesman. It was like a dream job of mine because, I, I don't know, Billy Mays died and then for whatever reason, it was like a cultural phenomenon. And I wanted to hop on TV and I wanted to sell products. I wanted, I had a bleeding capitalist heart and I wanted to sell things. I thought I would be good at it. And now I don't, I, I don't have anything close to that. <clears throat> you know, now I'm totally different. And now I just make content that I want to make and I'm not forced to sell anything to anyone. Let's take a look, boys, at this subreddit with the greatest infomercials of our time. Starting with, maybe you should start with something smaller. <laughs> is this what I think it is? <laughs> this is real? Are these all audio lists? Are these all audio lists, Tim? Because if they're all audio lists, 
then I don't know if they're the best thing to react to. <laughs> it feels like they're almost all just gifts. I think they are all gifts. Yeah, the rules, they have it posted as a gift. All right, let's try another subreddit then. No audio is kind of cringe. A-T-G-B-E. A-T-G-B-E. Awful taste, but great execution. I kind of love this. There's a lot of NSFW, though. A concerning amount of NSFW tags in this. Okay, definitely some of these things I can't show. But some of these I can. Hold my Cosmo? Is that like hold my beer but women? It is. It is exactly what it is. Hold my Cosmo. Yeah, let's do it. I did make a video specifically titled Only Men Have This Power. And let, let me tell you, this might be a, an interesting fact or a very disappointing fact. But the video I released called Only Men Have This Power had one of the highest click-through rates of any video I have ever uploaded. Like, the percentage of people who clicked on that title and thumbnail was higher than almost any other video. Which says something about society, I think. It's peculiar, is it not, that men would do such a thing? Not to mention that I start every stream with boys. How how about we stop working about his, his story and we start worrying about her story? You know what I mean? Anyway, here's Hey Bitch, Hold My Cosmo. It's the greatest posts of all time in a subreddit that is basically Hold My Beer, but for women. Let's take a look. This is what I'm dealing with, cry face emoji. Okay, this is what I, this is what I would wake up to in college and see on Snapchat. But hopefully it expands beyond that. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Where did you come from? How are you there? <laughs> okay, Bush Girl kind of sold it for me. Got to read the title. HMC while I have brunch, Sunday brunch with the girls. You know, I could have guessed that. I could have guessed that. That was an easy one. Context is it's Sunday brunch. <laughs> and Sunday brunch, Sunday brunch is almost like, uh, it's like a dangerous thing. Women out there, if you ever get invited to Sunday brunch, I want you to know that's other women trying to get you into the rabbit hole of becoming a wine mom. Okay? I'm not saying you can't go. I'm not saying it's not fun. I'm not saying mimosas don't slap on a Sunday. I'm just saying this is the rabbit hole that other women are sucking you down so they become a wine mom and you hang out and you drink wine all the time. This is how they hook you in. What if I want to be a wine mom? Then you better be setting up Sunday brunch. Okay, this one has no audio. Hold my Cosmo while I ace this shot. Stretch back. Great form. Lines it up. <laughs> Wait, I, I thought... I thought hold my beer... Isn't hold my beer usually pog champ moments? Isn't hold my beer supposed to be like, hold my beer, I'm about to go in. And then a guy does something kind of impressive? Is it a, giant fails? It's giant fails. It's guys doing dumb stuff? Okay. For some reason, I thought it was guys doing wins. This, what I thought would be me championing women and lifting them up and raising them up is instead us collectively laughing at women. 
in embarrassing situations and it's all fails all the way down. We're too late. We have to keep going. There's no way. Are you in VR holding a camera out of VR? What do you think you're doing? Do you think you're taking a screenshot? <laughs> Bro, just blink and memorize what you're looking at. There's no way this is real. <laughs> Boomers really are old and shit. Hold my Cosmo as I assert my dominance over Tony Hawk. Oh, wait, I remember this. Wasn't this a politician or something? Wasn't she somebody on the Hillary campaign? In 20, like 15 or something? A kickflip in heels is like so badass. I'm pretty sure she was on the Hillary campaign uh, campaign because that, that is the Hillary sticker, the Hillary Clinton campaign sticker. Hillary Clinton, let me tell you, was one beer pour away from winning the election. I'll say this every day of the week. This is the picture that made Hillary lose. She lost all of the Midwest with this picture. I haven't seen that big of a head game since Nancy Reagan. <laughs> All right, let's go next. Hold my Cosmo while I keep an eye out for my drunk friend. Oh, genius. Tie a balloon to her hair so you can't lose track of her. That's actually kind of genius. Hold my Cosmo while I show off my skills. Oh! Kind of handled it like a champ, though. Like, this was a really good backflip attempt, I would say. I've always wanted to do a stream, and I think Tyler One did this, where I start the stream and it ends when I successfully do a backflip. And every time I try, I'm too much of a pussy. Because I think I'm physically capable of jumping up, tucking, and then turning around in the air. I'm physically capable. Mentally, I'm not. I would, I would crumble. <laughs> that was good. That was great. No, that was great. Hold my Cosmo while I do my favorite party trick. Oh! What the fuck? Oh my God. Someone send that to the girl at the beach. She should be taking notes. Hold my Cosmo while I go get some milk. Right, guys. I'm going to try and get into Tesco like this. There's just one thing standing in my way. The security guard. Here they go, guys. <laughs> hey, so what are you doing? <laughs> I'm just getting some milk. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just getting some milk. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just getting some milk. <laughs> Oh, that's a fire face. It is only funny because she's British. You're right. You do that in America, you're a Karen. You do that in England, you are now a comedian, and you'll be on the next episode of Taskmaster. Hold my Cosmo as I walk to the dance floor. Yeah. Woohoo. Yeah. Right. Woohoo. <laughs> that's a pool. 
It's a pool. You just stepped over and stepped into the pool like it was a thing. <laughs> That's great. Hold my Cosmo. I think your vape is broken. <laughs> Classic. It's true love when you're walking home from, a, from your one night stand and he gave you pepper spray to protect yourself. Taint. Oh my god, my eye. <laughs> <laughs> it <hurts. laughs> It's true love when you're walking home from, a, from your one night stand and he gave you pepper spray to protect yourself. Taint. Oh my god, my eye. <laughs> it hurts. <laughs> That's fire. That's a great video. I will say, if you don't know, the amount of um, preparation that women have to do walking home from stuff is crazy. Cutie bought a bunch of, like, designer cutesy, like, knives. Literally, like, knives. Like, little palm knives that you clip onto your bag or something. And she w wanted to give them as a gift for Christmas and totally forgot... She brought them through TSA. Like TSA checkout, she had like five knives. TSA took all these like really cute like little – they were like like little like bumblebees and then they could like become a knife if they wanted. And they took them all and she like totally forgot. She totally forgot. She meant to put them in her bag, but we actually had to check in a bag through the security. She wasn't expecting to. She was really bummed about it, but it was like you don't even think about it. You know, you just kind of – you kind of have to have those things on you. If you're trying to get full protection. Now, obviously, don't spray pepper spray in front of you while you're walking into it. That's a little crazy, but <laughs> he's obviously been through this before. Okay, she's getting ratchet with it. Fair enough. <laughs> That's a dream couple. That's a dream couple right there. Hold my Cosmo while I walk on the yacht. Oh, it's so bad. And it just keeps go. Oh, it's like she gave up at the end. I hate the oh no 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 sound. I you know it's overused. It's it's definitely a, a, a little overused. It's had its moment in the sun. It should now go away. Look, I'm not even gonna blame alcohol there. That could just be seasickness. Even though they seem like they're at port. <laughs> Hold my Cosmo while I try to pass a drinking test. Maybe. Por favor, sí. Son ocho segundos constantes. Sope colabora. <laughs> there's no way there's no way that's what you're doing there's no way that's what you're doing to the lie detector i mean or the, not the lie detector the 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 alcohol test <laughs> that's, that's crazy that's crazy he said blow yeah i mean i guess yeah I guess, yeah, the breathalyzer. That's what I meant. <laughs> no, stop. Stop. I, I have to imagine it's on purpose, right? It's like, oh, off, oh, officer, did you want me to use this breathalyzer right here? All right, I guess I'll try. Oh. Wow. I wonder if there's any other breathalyzers. It feels like a porn intro at this point. Bro, you're not even blowing. <laughs> why is she why does she keep doing this? No, no, sopla, sopla solamente. It has to be fake. It ha I won't believe it unless it's fake. <laughs> Someone said Nancy Reagan POV.
Yeah, that is Nancy Reagan POV. Top game does not miss. Hold my Cosmo while I go to a batting cage. Watch out. <laughs> that was the absolute perfect second shot. I can't even I can't even talk shit here. I would love to talk shit here. I would love to. Like, nothing would make me happier, but this clip exists of me. <laughs> so, like, how am I going to talk shit when that's a real thing that I did? In the cars, Crocs. In the jorts. In public. Filmed. Hold my beer. Hold my Cosmo while I do shots with the girls. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Okay, that's simple. That's simple. That's easy. That's classic comedy. I will be the confident door of the explorer. Little Dora the Explorer. <laughs> Don't say it, chat. Don't say it. I know what you're thinking. Sloppy sausage. What did I just say? What did I just say? Sloppy sausage. All right. What did I just say? Come on, guy. Let's have a little maturity. All right, please. A little bit of maturity in this chat would be appreciated. <laughs> Yeah, Little Dora the Explorer. <laughs> oh my god. Stop saying look behind you, cuties there. I'd hear her because she'd walk into the glass. <laughs> uh alright, what's next? Fuck, I looked. Hold my Cosmo while I open a champagne bottle. Okay, alright, Andy. You have to choose right now. You have to choose. Travis? Oh, okay. Alex. Don't put your face over it. Oh, this is going to stress me out. I I just, I, it, it okay, you're fine. Okay. You have to oh my God. I'm not going to pause it. We're going to get through this. We're going to get through this. Thank you, Travis. We are so grateful. Oh, yeah. We're so grateful, Travis. <laughs> that was the oh, most wow. intense one <laughs> opening. Oh, yeah. Champagne idiot. Man. We're so grateful, Man. Travis. Marge. Did it did she dodge it though? We're so grateful, Travis. I think she dodged it. I can't tell because the frames. Oh no, it definitely glanced off her face. Champagne is a type of wine. No, it is not. There's sparkling wine, but champagne is different because it's from France. Hmm. Checkmate. Atheists. I'll take one for the team while mom takes one for the team. I'll take one for the team. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's a fire video. She was way too excited for that. <laughs> Mom was way too pumped to take one for the team there. That is a W mother trying to take one for the team there. You know how it is. She's feeling herself. <laughs> <laughs> Do not take one for the team. That's a crazy sign. Free beer, topless staff, and false advertising. What the fuck does this sign mean? Free beer, topless staff, and false advertising. Oh, free beer. Topless staff 
and false advertising. Oh, so this guy. There's free beer, topless staff, and false advertising. Ignore the first two. <laughs> great, great, great. Like three things you should know about my stream. Always on time, always funny, and everything I say is a lie. Is it like that? Okay, I'm getting it. I'm getting humor now. I'm, I'm I saw okay. this beautiful video of three friends in sync pouring wine from one to the other. I invited my friends over to try it with me. <laughs> Okay, first of all, that's not what even happened in the video. What happened in the video is one woman poured wine uncomfortably behind. And the, this guy just kind of like watched it like a father. Pouring wine from one to the other. I invited my friends over to try it with me. <laughs> they don't even do it they don't even i thought they were gonna do it and fail all they do is fart in the video ends easy enough man <laughs> that is the female yard the yard i saw the yard isn't reaching enough women so we went out and we find the ludwig slime and nick for women <laughs> who's ludwig who's slime who's nick who's amen vote at home <laughs> this is obviously slime <laughs> All we know is this is slime. <laughs> the rest, that's up to history, you know. That's up to hersery. Hold my Cosmo while I do a keg stand and flash this guy. Okay, I don't think I... She did a keg stand and a guy was holding her up by her ankles, but she was wearing a skirt. So the guy was looking just right into her hoo-ha and he made this face. But then he respectfully did this. You guys got to say, stop saying, look behind you. I keep checking. Hold my Cosmo while I get this party started. Shit. You better start shuffling. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, don't. Okay, thank God. This is like Kevin James in the movie Hitch. She's popping off. Hold my Cosmo while I get mad at my friends. Look, are you guys single or got boyfriends? Single. Single is a Pringle. I have a boyfriend. You got a boyfriend. Okay, so are you guys all friends with each other? Yes. Yes. All right, so do you guys know her boyfriend? Yes. yes. All right, so can we test his loyalty? Is it okay? Yeah. All right, so can I have these two girls call your boyfriend on one of their phones and see if they'll be down in Netflix and chill with your boyfriend behind your back? Is that okay? Yes. All right. Yes. Okay. Give him a jingle. All right, you got the number, right? Yeah, yeah. let me find it. But are you nervous, though? No, I trust them. I'm with Ashley. Oh my God. Okay. All right. We're just like, we're trying to leave, but like, we don't have a ride. Y'all can't call an Uber? No. Can you come get us and we can like maybe hang out or something? We kind of want to see you. Uh, yeah, I can do that. But like, Gina can't find out. Is that fine? Yeah, just don't tell her. Can we like come to your house though and hang out? Yeah, like watch a movie, yeah, yeah. get food just or don't something? Tell her. Just make sure you don't tell her. He said yes. Take the phone. Take the phone. Take the phone. She said yes. Are you fucking kidding? Take the phone. Take the phone. I thought we were like best friends since like what? Sixth grade? You're mad, you're mad, at, you're mad at them? Yeah, you're, I'm fucking pissed. No, you should mad. be mad at your man. <laughs> what? What? 
And That's your man. I mean, you guys called him, though. Like, you're literally my best friend. Crash crew. Like, what the fuck? It was for a video, though. It was for a loyalty check. Why are you mad at them? I mean, that's, 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 it's, it's, two, it's a two-way street. But, I don't know. But I told, I told him to call him. What? There's no way. It's got to be fake. It's got to be fake. I mean, I understand acting out of pocket right when you find out that the person you're dating isn't loyal, but certainly after recollecting her thoughts the next morning, she could apologize and then promptly break up with her boyfriend and then, you know, <laughs> not lose her friends so she has nothing left in this world that is crazy <laughs> the boyfriend is the companies that take down copyright stuff i am these two girls and then this is viewers after pokey and toast get banned yeah you're, i'm fucking pissed no, you should really be mad at your man that's your man i mean you guys called him though like you're literally my best friend crash crew like what the fuck that was and I'm like, what? Why are you guys mad at me? I didn't take him down. I don't. What do you want? I didn't. <laughs> that wasn't me, man. Hold my Cosmo while I try to do a handstand. Oh, Pog. <gasps> oh. <laughs> it's from a subreddit called Upvote Because Butt. <laughs> Reddit is too horny. Reddit is too horny for its own good, man. Upvote because but. <laughs> it was a pog recovery. Get up! Get up. Well, I said to do this. Ooh, yeah. Bam, give me that proof right back here. I deadass thought this was the office from the thumbnail. On the boat scene. Yeah, that was Pog. You definitely broke it down there. Pog? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I like the commitment. It's okay. No, you didn't. It's okay. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. Amanda. No, Amanda. Didn't. Amanda. Amanda. No, you didn't. You She's so sad. I know you're not okay. Uh, it made a funny noise, though. It won't be worth the concussion, but the noise was funny. <laughs> Just stand. Just stand up. Just stop moving. That's your worst fear. This is your worst fear? You just stand. Look how unbothered the security guard is. Couldn't care less. Just waltzes over and stares at him. Pog? That was a cool flip. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Cute. <laughs> You're a different level of drunk at that point. Oh, speaking of a different level of drunk, let me show you guys a video. I went to karaoke on Friday night with a bunch of people after going to a basketball game before I discovered I had had COVID. And, uh, and I was 
sober the whole entire time because I was driving, of course. But other people were very drunk and very rowdy. So you might have seen this clip if you look at the VOD channel. If not, though, no worries. I'll show it to you right now. This is what was happening. No, sorry, not this one, not this one, not this one, not this one. Friday night. Right here, right here. Mango was fighting people at the karaoke bar. We had a private room to do karaoke. And while people were singing karaoke, Mango was fighting the Australians. And anytime he would beat an Australian, he would start chanting USA over them. This didn't just happen once. This happened twice. While people were still singing karaoke. Two different Australians individually go both got their asses beat that night. <laughs> the Aussies didn't show up. The Aussies got rolled. I think it might have changed the course of Josh's life. One of the people got beat up. Josh. Soro, you might know him from Smash. He lost the fight. Then he looks at me and he's like, Oh, I'm in the gym tomorrow. And then Mango comes over and he's like, that's right. And tomorrow, you know what I'm going to be doing? I'm going to be sitting on my ass, drinking a beer, because I'm American. Bitch. Anyway. Sucks to be the one sober guy. Next video. <laughs> Oh, dude, that's a cartoon. <laughs> Dumps him off in a little a little tub of water. That's Amaranth after riding the horse. <laughs> Gets dropped off in a little tub of water. Goes live. <laughs> Seen this? <laughs> Give up on it, bro. No. Try it. No. I don't know, actually. Do it. Do you remember seeing me, though? It's going to break. You said something to me after. It's obviously going to break. Yeah. I said, hi, bro. Yeah, that's not. That guy, though, is a piece of shit. That guy who's just in there, like, do it. Do it. Trust me, do, you'll be fine. Just do it. Texas Moms Rock. What the fuck? Hold my Cosmo while I tackle the suspect who is looking into my teenage daughter's window. I mean, that's great form. Great form. Square it up. Square it up with the receiver. Follow the movements. Both hands on. Held him. Took him down. That's linebacker. That's Dante Hightower. All right, we got... Mm, we'll go until 16... She bangs out V-Vibes, V-6s even. <laughs> now every single post, people are just saying upvote because butt in chat. Don't push me. That's great, dude. I love new people using VR. Hold my Cosmo while I pour boiling water into a glass pitcher. Oh, it it's going to hurt your feetsies.
Yeah, glass is uh, precarious. Sometimes if you take a glass out of a dishwasher when it's nice and hot and then you immediately put cold water in it to drink, it'll break. They're that brittle. Oh, that's about enough of that, though. That's about enough of that. Upvote because funny. Like because hilarious. Just fucking kidding. Upvote because butt. Let's go, baby. Woo! Yeah, check it out. Damn, I thought I'd have something in there. Nothing in there. All right. What else? I, I didn't think my voice would be crashing as quickly as it has been today. What time is it? 6.30? We got a bit of time. We could do some super auto pets to round out our evening. I think that that's fair. I'm still a bit under the weather. And my voice has faded faster than I hoped it would have. I was hoping to go until about 8. But I think we have time for some Super Auto Pets, which I wouldn't mind playing because uh, we've been uploading a lot of Super Auto Pets onto the VOD channel. So let's go ahead and try that out. A little bit of Super Auto Pets. All right, everybody, it is time once again for some super auto pets. Eh, 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 eh. 